Other than people haven't watched the commercial anyway. Oh, you finally believe me on that? <laughs> What's going on, everybody? Friday Night Live. Tonight, we're finally building this. This is uh, VS410 Origin Limited, the Black Edition. This was the second release of the VS410 from Vanquish. It's been discontinued for a while now, but got a hold of one that was unbuilt. This one belongs to Jimmy Two Horses on the stream, but the body is not in here. Moose Jaw has the body, which I did not get from him yet, but it was time to finally build this. So we've had it for a while. Um, it's, like I said, unbuilt. The box is in, it's been beat up a little bit, but not terribly. These trucks were packaged in kind of a cool way with a CNC cut foam for all the uh, aluminum parts, which we will need. And, oh, he's got electronics and everything in here. We're not doing that, though. All right. So, we need to get to the rest of the parts. How do we know it's really a black edition without the body? Because the black edition refers to the aluminum parts, not to the body. And it says it on the box. And it says it on the box, so... There. All right. Where does um is? I don't know that. Did he mail it to you? He did. You mailed it to him and then he mailed it back. <laughs> well, I think we probably mailed it to somewhere else first and then then it probably went to him and then it it does have the updated braces. So, we got all kinds of stuff. Here. If scoring at home, there's a touch of black on the body. <laughs> What's that mean? <laughs> He's in Texas. He's in Texas. Yeah. Oh, he got a uh, screw kit here. K and K screw kit. I suppose he wants me to use this, even though I prefer the stock hardware. Uh. But. <laughs> What's that mean? Me or him? You. I mean, like he's. I'm like, building it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Even. So, open the first parts of that. I should have emptied my trash can before this started. You should have. I did not. Did you take though. the trash today? Down today? I did. Huh. Did you take whatever else was? What does that mean? Like recycle. Oh, it was or... green waste. We didn't have any. Yeah, I did. They put a we pumpkin took... in there. Damn it, Josh. Huh. Forgot about that. I was like, we haven't been here. We didn't have any green waste. I guess I was wrong. Hmm. Alrighty then. <laughs> so. Hello, everyone. I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Yeah, we were gone for Thanksgiving. We had a wonderful Thanksgiving. We were in Mississippi. We were in Gulfport, which is actually super awesome. Yep, Gulfport, Mississippi. And like Ocean Springs, and it's awesome. I mean, you know, we had a great time, obviously, with family, but like, oh my gosh, Gulfport's super cool. Yeah, no, it, it was. Like, it was a very cool little town, and I highly recommend it. I enjoyed it. So, for those that haven't seen it, this is upside down, but... um. The axles, we're starting with bag A1, like you would assume, which is the front axle. This is the uh, first app truck that had the D40, or second truck, I guess, that had the D44 axles. So we've got that there, and then we need, of course, the uh, diff cover. Oh, and steering knuckles. I forgot. Aww. So, what are you all in about? Uh, Randall has some cookies. Oh. I am having, I had this left in the fridge, extra scoop, this dessert inspired imperial sour in a little local brewery. It was very good. Oh, that's, yeah. I am having another Bloody Mary in my Scale Crawler Fab Shop glass. Hi, Desert Crawlers. Um, Ravensdale RC, don't worry about forgetting the trash and being wrong. I was almost wrong for the first time the other day. I don't know that I was technically wrong. 
Just lazy. No. Yep. So. All right. Let me get this thing go. I is built... there a pickle in there? What's happening? There is. What? A... Oh, there is. Everyone, apparently people noticed it. Mm. Did you eat in the uh, shed while in Ocean Springs? We did not. What? Where did we eat? I don't I remember what that little place was called. was called. Little bar that had live music going. And yeah, it was super fun. It was. We got to assemble the ring and pinion locker set up first. Um, but yeah, we got to hang out with the fam. Yep. We were down there for several oh, wow. days. Jimmy Two Horses, thank you for the $50. <laughs> for Nicole putting up with us nerds every Friday fund. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, sir. Yeah. Okay. I'm ignoring all of the pickle jokes. Well, so I had a pickle on the in my Bloody Mary yesterday. Wednesday? Yes, Wednesday. Wow, that was two days ago? Yeah, I know. How did that happen? I don't know. How did I lose an entire day? We had a really um, long flight home. And yeah. I think it just like has thrown us off this whole week. I think that it has And because well. it was Monday. And yes, I am enjoying the sour ale. I love the sour. Um, but yeah, we can't because it was on a Monday that we flew home, but it was like ended up being like almost eight hours of flying and it was a long it, yeah, it really was. It just kept going. Mm -hmm. Right, let's see. Okay, I need my spool. Where's like the actual spool? Sour or sweet pickles? Both. Sweet, uh, sour. I heard yeah. what that drink you have, but I can't seem to find it. Did you get it? Bevmo? No, we actually, I got it at Burning Barrel. It's right up the street from us, so. Yes. So yeah, it was interesting. Ryan Davis's birthday oh. is next week. He's gonna be thirty nine, but I was like, I'm twenty five. Hey, that's for you, right? The uh... uh, extra scoop is the flavor. I don't know. Sensation of biting into a decadent, juicy ice cream cone on a hot summer day. A tropical imperial sour base <laughs> infused with raspberries, pineapple, tangerines, lemon, and key lime. <laughs> While premium vanilla bean, milk, sugar, and a dash of marshmallow top off this creamy crusher. <laughs> that is a lot that is going a, on. That is a lot. Jeez. They are so descriptive. Oh, the unibody wheeler. We just hey, got hey. a cheap ram. Oh, I need to. Sorry, I didn't and email you back. going to have baby lambs. No. No. I do love... It was two flights. Jeremiah Salberg, thank you for the five dollars. Well, my wife said she did a thing. She sent me a hint. It was a Horizon Hobby. Your order is confirmed. I think she got me an SC at ten three straight axle. Well, that was nice of her. Hey, hey, bonus. Those were a pretty good deal going on right now. So what? The SCX three straight axles. They were on sale. No, Lenny. No. Exactly. It's like. That's what I have to repeat to her. <laughs> ben says this puppy is driving Nancy and I nuts. Oh, I didn't show you pictures of their new puppy. You didn't. Oh, it's so freaking cute. I would never be able to find it in our chat. He'll have to see. I actually do love lamb as well to eat. Um, <laughs> 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 but I like to think it's. It's what? Sheep. It is. It's not. It's right. Just, it's just like, you know. Right. I would never cow eat, is beef. It's just I would never eat like veal or anything like that. You never would? No. Okay. Absolutely not. Oh, I don't I'm not just saying. And I would I, never I'm eat. I've had it. I don't like it. I would not I would never. That's bad karma putting it in your body. What about foie gras? How does it say? Foie gras. No, I wouldn't eat that either because it's not, not I mean not necessarily like ducks or assholes, but like I don't that sounds gross. <laughs> yeah. Like, it just sounds gross. 
Scott Oaklander had to order a set of 10 three straight axles after he watched the scale news. <laughs> that kind of deal, you got to do it. Greetings. Silver SDX6 arrived in my local hobby shop. Now I wonder, should I buy it and be first to own that beast in Estonia or wait until March when the snow goes away? Oh, that's a tough one because you're going to get it and have to have that around the house but can't drive it. I mean, it do probably it probably do pretty well in the snow. It's big enough and heavy enough. Rob, forgive, thank you for the five dollars. Flannel and a sweater. Third world Cali. Turn off the power again. <laughs> Here's a fiver to put some firewood on the or a generator. <laughs> no, I just turn. I just only have the heat up to sixty nine. Nice. Because I don't know. I don't. Yeah. We we have not lived here that long, but have already turned into like California not climate me. people. You, what? Not what, me. What happens every time you go back in the heat? In the his kid, the, your kids could play with it indoors, except for it's huge. It is. Whatever happens every time we go back to the Midwest and the humidity, you're just like, oh my god. Oh well, yeah, the humidity, but not. Um. <sighs> Uh, Dan, Dana Surratt said I had to order the Sky RC Bluetooth scales after watching Wednesday's Christmas <laughs> list show. Um, hopefully, you guys use his links. Yeah. Because that's very helpful. Putting that flannel all the way up like Matt. No. <laughs> My collar looks all messed up, though. It's been off and on a few times today. It was a busy day. Hot and cold. Right? Yeah, Sookie is screaming. Sookie's on one tonight. <sighs> what is this? Who's it? What is what? Cut out stuff with the cricket. Uh, that is from Team Garage Hack. Oh, TGH, guys. TGH. Blind guy, RC. Thank you for the $5. He says, hi, I love my origin. I do want to try and put the Phoenix body cage set up on the origin, though, or get the truck from the... Pro Ultra, stay classy. Yeah, thank Always. you, thank you, thank you. And yeah, you could put the uh, since the chassis is the same, it'll all drop on there. God damn. What? Gunner, thank you for the five dollars. What did he say? Let's do another discount co code. Fun Buzz Nicole fifteen off goes through the weekend for satisfied jerky. <laughs> Fun Buzzed Nicole fifteen. <laughs> do they have to spell my name right. N I C O L E is the only way to spell Nicole. So many people, so many people spell it with an H. Even people. Oh. On here. Nicole. No, it's like Nicole. <laughs> <laughs> um, what's your opinion on high clearance links? I'm trying to put my rig because where I calm. A lot of the guys are able to get a zero their score. Uh, um, I don't typically run high clearance links on my scale rigs because I don't like the way they look. If you're going first comp and you're trying to get you know the most of everything all the time, then yeah, I get it. But I'm guessing that guys who are getting a zero uh, aren't necessarily getting a zero just because of high clearance links. It's all about drive time and practice and more practice and more practice and more practice. It's okay. I, it doesn't bother me if you add an age. It just, I just was saying that so that if people are putting it in, I'm not like personally offended by it. Um, hello, everyone. What would all of you suggest for first caller for my 10 year old son? Trax TR4 Sport or Element Gatekeeper? TRX4 Sport. It is for a kid, it's the best, probably the best way you can go. It's super crazy durable. Um, and that's the most important thing for giving your remote to a small child. Um, Jason Sexton says, I'm about to buy my first Vanquish kit. My question is, can you add a dig unit to any of them out of the box? I want portals in the whole nine yards. Yes. Uh, there's a dig for any Vanquish truck that's been released. Uh, if it's the Ultra, then you can get the VFD dig. The Pro, same one. Um, the Origin, limited or... The black, which were before, use a regular Hertz dig. And then the Phoenix comes with it in the box. So, there you go. Um, John Windsor, welcome. So, it's newbie in the house. Thanks for joining. Hello. I've been doing some house remodeling. Modeling. Finally get to sit down and relax. My favorite show. Hey. 
Oh my gosh, Scott Quick says, love the both of you watching on the big screen, typing on my phone. <laughs> that is, I literally like probably wake up at night having nightmares about thinking about people having us on a big screen. <laughs> like, that's terrifying. It's, like I, I don't belong in high definition. No, for sure. like there is no, no, like this is a Monet. Don't look too close. <laughs> like <laughs> the turkey jerky is fantastic. It is. Who's talking about it? Uh, Randall Hill says, I can't wait to try me that turkey jerky. I'm telling you, it, 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 see Nicole as well. I'm not. It is good. I mean, it's probably one of my top three favorites. Of Look that. at all these big screen. Um, that's terrifying. My son started <laughs> with Deadbolt SCX-10 too, cause it was cheap at the time. He was six or seven back then. Yeah. I mean, they were, but like. Somebody just said so, that smudge on my glasses gets annoying. Like <laughs> I can't even see a smudge. Oh, there is. That is the. No. <laughs> Who's watching on the biggest big screen? No. I wonder if someone's on an 80 inch or better. No, I'm about. <laughs> Please, no. <laughs> Can you imagine how much bigger my head is on a, that? No. Started assembling my Ultra Kit last night. Was not excited to see the shocks need to be built, unlike <laughs> the Pro Kit I have. Yeah, a little bit of a difference there. A Friday Night Live on the, at the drive-in. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Blind guy, you didn't, you didn't have the baby, but you watched while your baby was being born. I found out Taco John's is not bringing back the Apple Grande. I'm one ticked-off Midwesterner. We ain't, Taco John's is not. Taco... I'm, okay. I got to move the cup so that you can see the Scale Crawler Fab Shop logo. Oh, perfect. Taco John, six pack and a pound. Well, they, <laughs> six pack of tacos have, and a pound of tops. They have the little top, the little potatoes. Thing. Yep. Sure do. Cheers. Oh, six, my God. Six pack and a pound. Watching on a big screen or a phone in the shower? <laughs> I mean, if you're a phone king on the shower, that's pretty cool. Man, can you imagine how much more time I would have with my phone? Say what? <laughs> if my phone worked in the shower. Uh, God, you're, no. You need some alone time. <laughs> like, you need some time to be disconnected. But then I could play more Golf Clash. Is that the one part tomato juice, two parts vodka, ten parts hot sauce in Josh's drink? Probably. Pretty much. Pretty much true. I'm a big fan of hot Curtis, sauce. Curtis, man, thank you for joining. There's probably less vodka in it than yeah, most people than most people would assume. Yeah. I'm, I really like the flavor. I don't really need the alcohol. And when I make it, Nicole's like, not much of a Bloody Mary. I know. It's more Mary than... Anything else? Um, uh, I watch SNU in the shower every Tuesday. <laughs> yeah, let's get on news. Uh oh, let's get on news um, update. <laughs> hi from Florida. I'm using a projector outside. Scares off stray cats and neighborhood kids. That's what my mom says. So you're just drinking fancy V8, says Jesse. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Curtis man finally caught a stream. Welcome. I mean, I'd be lying if I said I've never had the lives or a new video drop on while on the throne. Oh. oh. That's that's uh that's YouTube time. I mean, I learned so I've learned so much on how to with carbon fiber. You I can't even. Oh, we're not even going to go there. I have so Josh much. Josh seems excited about Tots as Napoleon Dynamite. Boy, give me some more Tots. <laughs> give me some more Tots. Um, I, I just started learning how to braise rod and tube. Oh, you're circling and we're red. Um, to start doing my own cages, looking forward to downloading some of your designs. Nice. Hope you. I hope they are helpful. If nothing else, it just takes that part of the thought process away so you can focus on the other part. It's the best part of them. Just just helps you focus on what you need to pay attention to most. Brian Sherwood, thank you for the $2. Nothing to say now. Stay tuned. <laughs> <laughs> um, blind guy says, I called the office. Yeah. Well, he works from home quite a bit. <laughs> 
<laughs> Johnny says, Josh, I've been looking on Vanquish website at the F10 axle housings, but can't find the axle internals, the axle and gears, etc. Will the internals from the F9s work? The ring and pinion gears are the same. Um, the, the, uh, what do you call it? The gears in the portals are the same as the Curry F9s that we make. Um, but the stub axles and the axle shafts are different. Those That stuff will all come and be available separately here before too long. It's just a matter of getting everything caught up and having all the parts available before they're, you know, you could technically assemble them from scratch, but that'll all come. Everything will be available. Who is this dude interrupting Nicole's live stream? Oh my God. <laughs> Hi, Robbie. Hello from SAC. I have a fuck cancer hat for Josh and two fuck cancer shirts oh, yeah. for you. There's the... <gasps> Yay! I already put one on my toolbox oh, over here. Good. So, so Robbie, Love it. I met Robbie at Folsom Lake at the. Uh, we were at a fundraiser, fundraising event together a couple of weeks ago, and he gave me a couple of stickers that now live on my toolbox. Yes. A, 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 Appreciate uh, the sentiment. Yeah, a, a cause we can all get behind. Yep. Thank you. Come on. Kerosene, thank you for the five dollars. Give us the cute little fox and number one. <laughs> so, there, oh, there it's seated. What is your deal? She has been running on the wheel at night, so which is not normal. Like we've said, she normally does it for attention when we're standing right there, but right now she has been just putting the miles on that wheel. Josh, I downloaded your tube chassis on your website. Do you print them to get the one one size so the tube matches the pint tube that is correct print tube yeah um some of them have to be printed at 11 by 17. um i think it's real clear on that there's also there's instructions on how to print them on my website Why but there's like to print it it's like a it gives you a perfect thing so you can like bend it and then put it on there and be like oh. make sure it's exact that's cool yeah that's nice adam you're killing me i haven't been home what after the first of the year i'll be home um, is it your internet or mine that's making it look like I've been drinking all day and no, I haven't. No, we're still pretty good right now. Um, I don't know. Well, we all put on some weight during the holidays. I don't know. Were we talking about that? No. Okay. I think that's just a general Maybe. question. Yeah. I don't think that's pointed at it's us. It's true. Yeah, our, we do, we are going to go back on our stupid diet afterwards though. Is Josh a living encyclopedia for Vanquish products? Yeah. I should be. Hey, Josh, any chance of clicking has been completely figured out in the VFD2? Um, it's it's not always the same for people. So, like, it's just the number of gears. And, like, I've had one that in hand, and I've been like, oh, this one has a click. And then I was able to fix it with a couple of shims. But that Thank doesn't you, work Rand. for everybody. So it seems like it's not the... It's a combination of a lot of gears and cogs and stuff. Mm, the cat on the wheel, Nicole, trying to take off a few pounds. I know. I need me a wheel. Um, let's see. Check your setting. What lens are you using? Could be aspect ratio if you change lenses. Must uh, Talking to me? No, my lens. I mean, I'm running a fixed. Kansas. Kansas. I'll be in Kansas soon. I run a fixed 16 millimeter prime sigma lens um yeah I will. we're clear on this end we've got our monitor above us so. hello from napa matt harris and and um bobby morphine from kansas they're in napa right now <laughs> yay kansas <laughs> yep i'll be back there soon yep not sure if i will be but I know, Let's flights see. are crazy. This year is ridiculous with flights. Mm -hmm. VFD twinned machined gears, are they close? Um, They're coming. I'm not, I don't have a... Do you prefer... Not giving a time frame. Solid point. rod or tube? Um, solid rod is super easy to work with, super easy to bend as far as like not having to worry about kinking. Um, but I do like how light tubing is. Um, and it's also easier to braise tubing because it takes less heat. So they both have their pros and cons. Um, it really kind of depends. If you're brazing only, it's probably tubing's nice. Um, Swoof is debating on driving to SAC on Sunday. Why would you drive here? Yeah, what's going on here? 
I have from Jamaica. That's Whoa. cool. Fun. Just saw a 19 CRF 450L in sack. I may go spend some cash tomorrow. Oh, is that Gunner? Yeah. Bring, <laughs> yeah. bring a goat. Bring a goat. All right. The front D44 is complete. When are you going to do a video on budget motor options for the Phoenix? Um, I'm planning to try and get all of that done. I'd like to get the that done this weekend. I got a radio. That's a There's a Spectrum DX5 behind me. And I got that specifically for that video um what soldering station do you recommend i've got a track power one that i've used for a long time but honestly i use the ts100 the most now which isn't a soldering station at all it's a real simple like pen style one holy shit andrew decavia says i'm in georgetown so i drive through sack twice a day on my commute to san francisco Holy crap. Wow. That is a... I've met people who live in Sacramento who have never been to San Francisco. <laughs> Isogen, thank you for the $2 VS410 RGB underglow kit win. <laughs> yes. That would be I cool. am on board with that. I love RGB. I have friends in Orangevale and I'm on in vacation next week. Been oh. binge watching older videos. Why does Josh bug Nicole for pronouncing it Caterpillar correctly? Because <laughs> it's no one says Caterpillar <laughs> I manually change the resolution is completely fine. YouTube just wouldn't auto up it for some reason. Oh. Bloody Mary past noon? My. Silver lines, clutching his pearls. Um, <laughs> oh my. Does Nicole know she's getting an SCX6 for Christmas driven up the Christmas tree for <laughs> it? I already have one. And I don't, it's in my garage. I don't need the one that we have. <laughs> stupid ass thing that pissed me off so hard when you brought that in <laughs> like it literally did i pissed me off i was he sent me a picture and i just assumed that it was a scx 24 on top of an scx 10 10 <sighs> <laughs> and i was like oh, okay cool why are you sending this to me i literally don't care about this at all like i was like that's what my biggest concern was like why are you did you send this to the wrong person yeah. like thank you like. <laughs> ah and that made it even better because oh, you had no yes. idea and i was like oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you just wait i'm pissed um, just getting into crawlers and pulled into watching all your shows with SCX 24s. Oh, nice. What's an e skate? Wait, what? get two SCX 6. Now you have e skates, yeah, e like 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 e bikes, but skates. Just join. Hope I he doesn't use his e bike, he doesn't need e skates. Hope I miss much. Needless to say, I'm out if you squat that thing. <laughs> no squatting this mainly because it's not mine. This oh. is going to. Jimmy Two Horses' daughter was born at the Air Force Base in Sac, right across from Vanquish. Oh, McClellan. Yeah. Yes. I have a Tanka Winnebago RC conversation with RGB lights everywhere. <laughs> um, I also use a TS100, but I don't like how bad it handles larger gauge wires, like 6S+. Yeah, I don't use it on anything that large because I rarely do anything that large, honestly. Uh, um, but if I ever need to, then I've got my old track power. But it's honestly, my, my track power is 15 years old. Vaughn Perry Photography, where's Cat out there? Brad's in here? Oh. That's Brad. Oh. I'm like, photography, Perry Photography, I know. Oh, Brad, which one do you want to see? We miss you. I haven't seen you forever. Um, Swoof was born at Mather. Hey, even closer. Yeah. Uh, Carolina squat illegal in North Carolina now. I saw that today. I want e skates. I don't. What? What? Why would you need e skate? I don't understand that. Nicole, get, next time Nicole gets mad, drape a towel over her like a superhero cape. Now and you're say, super mad. <laughs> <laughs> Put GoPro on the front of your SDX six and have it run errands for you. I can tote. It can tow 200 pounds. Put a little speaker on it and you can yell at people. Or you can use your feet. Feet. Or your vehicle. Like, God. Says you, the person who doesn't leave to go do errands for anything. If I have to, I will. Would you? Huh? Would you? There's Sookie. She's on the wheel. 
Eric Baker, thank you for the $5. Josh, since rock jocks won't fit on the RC Speedy chassis, will they fit on my Phoenix? Any issues? No, they won't fit on the Phoenix because Phoenix needs an offset front axle because of the VFD. Just wait till Josh brings on the SDX 6x6. <laughs> no. No. Nicole ain't having the nerd talk. Punch up fool. I need a wine. Okay. BRB. BRB. I was surprised to see that you didn't have wine already when you asked me to stop and get it, but then Well, I only had one beer. Ah. Oh. But did you see the ex the TikTok of the extreme bobbed Ford Ranger? I did. <laughs> I'd be more interested in an SCX six by six than an SCX six. Telling you, the SCX six is awesome. There's they're some of the most fun to drive. Now, I wouldn't have it only like I if I didn't have a one tenth scale car, I would have one tenth scale first. Oh my god, Suki. Like you understand, like that's the cats that like, oh, you have pretty cats, but they're annoying as shit sometimes. And then I listen to both of them argue. Nicole's arguing with the cats right now. It's ridiculous. So, let's see. All right. Rear axle. I'm going to put the shims on the pinion shaft. Well, oh, second. We're going to put both shims on. All right. How do you com How do we combine two SCX6 make a mega SCX mega desk? All right. Look who I found. Hi, Jeefy. Uh, big boy. Oh, so big. Hi, buddy. No, sir. Um. Oh. It. Really, they don't need to make a six by six. Just make a pastor axle kit, and people in RC land will handle the rest. Right. <gasps> what? Hey, <you're> buddy. <gasps> Hi. What's up? Hi. So, um, if anybody needs a Christmas gift for their wives, you can say the cat for the. Nespresso. The Nespresso. Yeah, Nicole bought herself a no, very... No, your mom bought it for us for Christmas. Yes, yes, that was our Christmas gift. Um, and it is amazing. Yes, what is it called? A Nespresso machine. Yeah, but isn't there like a model? It, Nespresso's a brand. Well, yeah, but it's like a Nespresso machine. Okay. I mean, it's a Nespresso machine. I don't know. But it's amazing. Makes amazing espresso. <sighs> Um, what? The 10 six by six didn't sell well. I can't imagine them making a six version. Oh yeah. I, I can't imagine that either. And, uh, the cost of that thing could be, I don't know what my favorite is yet. We just got it, <laughs> but it's so awesome. It, it really is amazing. It's like a virtual. Can I just order whatever jewelry the girl put in the cart online? <laughs> <laughs> yes, you could do that. Chiefy. They're just, they're just little shitheads today. Wife wants a $300 toaster. I love, I would like to see it, but what's a $300 toaster? I don't, I have no idea. Maybe it has sensors. It Does it do things. like tens? 10 pieces of toast at once? No, we don't even have a toast. We don't, which we should, because there's a lot of times I've been like, we need a toaster. Uh, you just put it in the pan. I'm not, I don't have room for an, an espresso machine if I have a toaster on the counter as well. True. 
<sighs> and we very rarely have bread. <sighs> we now have two Maine Coon kittens, a litter robot, and one fast cat wheel. <laughs> and ten dogs. What? The thoughts on the Dyson hair dryer is fabulous. Have you used that thing? Uh, yeah. It looks cool. It does look cool. Um, but yeah, if you're going to get it, then you should talk to me first. I get a discount. It was Ben. Oh, I was, I was like, I was like, how do you want someone like that to talk to you? Because they're going to have to write you a letter since you never remember your phone. Oh no. I tried calling Nicole a few times today. And then I text her and then like, I don't know, an hour or two later, I get a response. And I was like, uh, I was like, 19 is you... minutes. I was just like, are you awake? Like what's going on? Obviously I was like, your phone went right to, it just didn't ring at all. She's like, oh, I had it on airplane mode. I was playing a game. I was like, oh. You taught me how to do that. That you don't get all the long ads. <laughs> what game were you playing? Rummy, gin rummy. What? I didn't want to talk to you anyway. <laughs> I mean, it wasn't important, but still. Right. Why did you call? Why would you call me at three o'clock in the afternoon anyway? I don't know why I was that calling. That was annoying. Don't I don't know why me. I was calling you during the day. Yeah. We don't. During the day, we don't like talk on the phone. No. We might text. Don't call but me. Generally, I call her when I leave work and be like, do you need anything on my way home? Or I tell her where I'm going after work because. Yeah. There's gen I generally have a stop or two to make. Like, don't call me during the day unless something's on fire. Yeah. Okay, no bullshit. A four-wheel steer Capra or an SCX6? Ooh, those are very different price points, but... Josh, I sent you a link to a $300 toaster. Jeremiah Salberg did. <laughs> it's on sale for $280. No. Um, man. Hello, well, just calling to say he loves you, Nicole. Don't call me. <laughs> <laughs> Like, no. And she knows that's not why I wasn't calling. Yeah. Like. Does Vanquish have a storefront? We no. do not. Nope. We are a closed facility. You have to go to your local hobby shop. Support your local hobby shop. Six scale Capra 4WS. Ooh, that would be fun. It's a real hard choice between that the Capra. Like, I like them both for different reasons. But, um. I think you're both pretty. <laughs> right. Matthew Jorgensen says the kittens are awesome. Thank you for sharing your kittens with us. If I call the house, I can't reach anyone. I call Alexa. Speaker time. <laughs> my wife, Nikki, doesn't answer my calls when she's with her boyfriend. So, yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was with my boyfriend, Chief. <laughs> Do you have shop tours at Vanquish? No, not typically. It's a, it's a whole thing. So, it's... You know, like bringing people through the shop or, yeah. Uh, I, I've, I've let, I, you know, I've, I've taken friends through there and things like that, but like just general tours, not normally. Yes, I caught you live. Koi Works from Australia. Hey, what time is it? Six. I bet it's Saturday there. Shut up. The 4WS has changed Josh's mind on the Capra? It has. It actually has. What's the MSRP on this kit? This kit was nine hundred dollars, eight ninety nine, but it hasn't been available for a few years. Oh, I snagged a riff for two two eighty Black Friday deal mm -hmm. from Amy. And thanks for the heads up on the scale news for that dude. Hey, no problem. Is that a Vanquish parts tray? It is. They're rubber parts trays. They're super nice, Elf and they're like eight so. like eight bucks. Ponce says thanks for the honcho videos. Hey, I'll no problem. Bet if you if someone licks your office window enough, you'll let them. <laughs> You know what? You think, that wouldn't be that odd in our area. So that's not nor our normal response. But Robbie, yes, you can. <laughs> Ever, we get people who come around that they you know, shoo them all. Get out of here. Get on get. Get on get. Get on get. Get on out of here. <laughs> that's what my dad always used to yell at squirrels and shit. Get on out of here. <laughs> okay. Front and rear axles are done. I haven't looked at the instructions at all. Can you make that tray for a one one? I could use one, David. Hey, Is that David. Hard? Uh -huh. David. <laughs> I'm using a motel wash rag as a parts tray. 
Those are the best ones because then you don't have to. Where was, I have not seen little David for so long. You should see how huge he is. I know. Oh my god. He's taller than me. What's the best rims for a VS410? It's all personal preference. I mean, obviously, Vanquish ones is my choice, but there's lots of lots of options out there. Okay, so low C limit or Kyo for USA one. I know you're not a monster truck guy, but uh, low C LMT would probably be my route. Jeremiah, um, Pro Line, Pro Line, right? What? Ax he's going to come to California for either Axial Fest or Pro Line. Um, Pro well, Line is probably get in trouble for saying that, but no. I mean, they're both their own by the same people. Um. I do like Proline. I think the terrain is better at Axial Fest, but like Proline by the Fire is a really cool event. It's in uh this it got just got announced for next year. It's in October. And it is uh And it's by Big Bear Lake. You could go there too. It's medieval themed this year. Oh, Jesus. Like you guys oh. need more of the theme stuff or anything to prove that you're bigger nerds than you already are fucking fake swords and armor and shit. <laughs> <laughs> sword fighting in the desert like that's so weird like that like you haven't seen that in rc event before uh sword try. fighting good try i don't think i've specifically seen sword fighting i challenge you to a duel <laughs> Any thoughts on pre-runner suspension set up in an STX-10, i.e. associated IFS and Yeti trailing arms? I don't, I don't know. I mean, it, they just never really work that well at our scale, at, at like with our solid axle trucks. I, I don't know. I feel like you're better off with solid axles. Will your, will your first t-shirt design just be the word dumbass? Dumbass. <laughs> saw that you were moving machines out Instagram today. Slow down on product. No. Uh, low down on what? Slow down on product. Definitely not. No. Two were leaving so that a much bigger piece could come take its place. What's your opinion on spec RC wheels? I've never ran them personally. Um, <laughs> the, you know, the outside face design looks pretty good, although they look like a pretty RC heavy solid Thank you. That's what I was going for. RC jousting? Hmm. Um, no idea. Cool. I just so happen to have a sword. <laughs> <laughs> Love SNU. What tires do you prefer for indoor comps from GR Michigan? Oof. Uh, I would still, I mean, I guess if I was really, really. <laughs> we're meant, I'd probably we're try Hyrax first. We're around the woods looking for fights. Um, I love that movie. What is that from Robin Hood Men in Tights? Or yeah. what is it? We're men. We're men in tights. I guess. I just... Really? That was a huge leap for you. That's I mean the only thing I know with tights in it in a movie, so um Jimmy Two Horses, thank you for the five dollars. Crawl or jousting or we revolt. I mean it could be fun. There's going to be so many Max D bodies on trucks. <laughs> <laughs> All the spikes. <laughs> um Axel dropping the SMT-10 in lieu of the low C LM, 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 LMT. I'm looking forward to meeting Josh and that guy from Canada in Alabama. Yes. I would imagine that Axial is dropping the LMT. So will there be period costume contest? I mean. Oh my It won't surprise me. Hey, Basa, good to catch one. Been a while. I know. Are you going to eat that pickle? <laughs> Just. Every... Have a good night. I'm tired of the spinning wheel of internet death from my life. I... Oh, sorry, Mike J. Right. What is happening out there? Oh, I heard the. So I still have a rock van body, a Proline rock van. And that is Sookie's house. She spends a lot of time sitting in that or under whatever. And I heard it just go flying. I heard one of them run into it. Oh, the man body? Yeah. What kind of badness will Vanquish release next? 
<laughs> what was that? I don't really know. I just there's a lot of noises happening out there, and I'm not gonna ask right now. Oh my god, there's some craziness. I do not know what they're doing, but I don't know that I want to know. Let's see. Excuse me. Ugh. Bless you. Thanks. Inappropriate. Uh, hey, these are these eights or tens? <sighs> Tens, wait, eight, eight. That's why. Thank you. Getting into plastics, definitely need to get the driver. I heard a 1500 googly eyes to glue all over my rock van body. Only way I could come up with a way to make it look good. <laughs> 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 huh. Moose Jaw for sure has a kilt. You think Moose Jaw is a kid? I can, Moose Jaw is an no, old. No, he said it. What? He's an old school rocker. I didn't see that. I would have guessed Moose Jaw had leather pants before a kilt. <laughs> Phoenix's mom was super into the Renaissance Festival. Eating. Did Phoenix grow up eating turkey legs? Mm. Um. DK also has a kilt. Apparently it's a thing. Who does? DK. Jesse says nothing wrong with a kilt. Nothing wrong with a kilt. No. I'm not going to necessarily immediately disagree with all of you, but I'm secretly judging from a distance. <laughs> he said he has those too, but they don't quite fit anymore. <laughs> 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 Did no one ask Josh what flavor the gaskets were on the Phoenix? <laughs> Wait, is there get? Oh, there is gaskets on the Phoenix. I'm currently wearing cow print shaft and nothing else. Okay. <laughs> Inappropriate. There you go. So if I wear my kilt, can I still represent Vanquish at the booth? I promise you won't be the worst dressed. Oh, really, Mr. Pickle Eater on a live stream is going to judge us? Yeah. Yeah, I will. <sighs> um. Okay. And I think that I did a, a properly shielded to avoid any community guideline issues. How's the weather? It's... Cold. It is kind of cold. I don't know if it got above 60 something today. Stem or stemless wine glass? Well, this one's stemless. I think, oh no, we have some with stems, don't we? Yeah. We've graduated to that level of adult. Mm. They're like, none of them match. They're all like, they're all from wineries. places. Yeah. yeah like. <laughs> <laughs> uh. 75 in Missouri today. Is it supposed to rain next week? I don't know. Probably not. <laughs> Have you ever had an interest in one eighth buggies and truggies? I'm just building my first one now. No, I'm not much of a racer. Just ordered that screwdriver. You'll be mad you waited so long. Nick LaRue says, says, happy holidays. Happy holidays to you. I recently got my mom a cup like that for her coffee. I have a lot of them for coffee. They're a great decision. <laughs> yeah, but none of yours like work the way they're supposed to because I put them in a dishwasher. Washer? Dishwasher. I put them in the dishwasher. <laughs> so they the seal, you know. I don't think that that's true. What? I think I think that they all still have their seal. Mm, I don't think so. I one of them I decided to throw away today. Why? Because the paint is flaking off around the lip, and I'm just like, probably don't need it. Maybe I don't need that. Maybe I don't need to ingest paint with all of the coffee I drink. Um. I was just like, I remember the first time I ever went to a casino by myself, and it was. Why would you go to a casino by? Not, not like no. I'm like, I was 18, and I, me and my friends went. Like, why would you go to a casino when you're 18? Why wouldn't you? 
you when you turn 18, you have to go to a casino, a strip club. I thought you were going to be 21 to gamble. Not at Indian casinos. Um, and this one was in, I can't remember what it's called. It's just it's north of Omaha, I think on the Iowa side. Anyway, uh, but it was still quarters then. You still put quarters in. So you oh. had like a buck. And you're old. And I remember how like nasty our fingers were, like from putting all those quarters in. And then I specifically remember we all were driving home. And I remembered that, and we stopped at Burger King. And then <laughs> we finished, we're still driving. And I remember looking at my hands and being like, my fingers are clean. And I definitely didn't wash my hands. Ew, why are you doing It was like all Ew. the french fries and it's like <laughs> ew sleep over missouri's version of a sleepover spending the night <laughs> oh because you yeah we didn't say spending the night or we didn't say sleepover we said spend the night oh yeah right oh that's a difference in i don't know huh. apparently interesting huh. are you having issues with the phoenix portal gears uh-uh council Bluff. yeah it was definitely in council mm. bluffs no, it was for, it was before any of the casinos were in Council Bluffs. It was further north, little place. So, yeah, that was before Harrah's or any of those even existed. <laughs> those came when I was, like, in high school. What? Harrah's and um, uh, I think Ameris. The boats. That's, yeah. Yeah, the, no, there was no boats when I was in high school. Hmm. Who's waiting for Josh to take a drink get violated by that pickle? I am, says Brian. <laughs> 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 Just boop. Um, yeah, they... Would you recommend a VS410 chassis kit for a custom crawler build? Sure, I've done a bunch with them. Was it near the Playhouse? No, other direction. The Playhouse was right next to my dad's... Uh, oh, yeah, we drove by that. The facility my dad owned. The library or whatever? It was called the Playhouse. Right. Oh, because it was a theater. Yeah, Performing Arts Center. Performing Arts Center. That was what it was. <laughs> Amateur night on Tuesdays. Did you ever go to Prey Meadows Casino in Altoona? Nope, never heard of it. Altoona. Wizard warning in effect for Hawaii? What? Heard that, yeah. What? Like, how do they, how would that? So I said too. It's like I was unaware that was possible. It is? We are learning geography related things together tonight. I don't that there's an exotic dance club called the library in SoCal. There you go. Would you suggest a 24th or 10th scale RC for a kid's first RC build? I feel the larger RC works better in most applications. Yeah, I think that the larger one is probably the better route. How, hello, Max M. How many Vanquish servo horns do I need for the unit? Um, you'll want uh, a 20 millimeter for the steering and then a two 24 millimeters, one for the dig, one for the um, overdrive. What did you say about the 10th scale or 24 scale? 10th scale. I yeah, think. that'd probably be easier to work on. Yeah. Jimmy well, Two Horses, yeah. thank you for the $5. I'd like to give a shout out to my local hobby shop, Hobby Town in Lubbock, Texas. Lubbock! For help in procuring the parts for this build. Nice, that's where Bailey was from. Oh! The only person I ever knew from Lubbock. Just toss in a 55 and 14 pin and you can't crack it. With all the hype on the anti-foams from Three Brothers RC, have you tried them yet? No, I haven't. I don't, I don't know. I probably will, but... The volcanoes have two caps, you can go skiing. Eight in the morning, surf in the afternoon. Hmm. That's where Buddy Holly was from. What else? Behind. Big oven goes up to 12K or more elevation. Yeah, but like a blizzard on the island. I have to look this up. Um, What are your personal thoughts on the 118th RTRs from FMS? The one eight, I haven't owned the one eighteenth ones. I've got the their one twelve scale ones, and they're nice. Um, but I haven't owned any of the one eighteenth, so I don't know. I'd I'd hate to have 
too much of an opinion without trying one. Well, that's a first. Is there a clutch on that DeWalt screwdriver? Yep, that's why I, I keep adjusting here on the nose. Buddy Holly and Hobby Town are the two claims to fame in Lubbock. <laughs> Whoops. I see Josh trying that one three brother sent him a full set. No, I just... We'll see. We'll see. Pooty Ma Goose. <laughs> <laughs> nice snort. Modeled and printed my own anti foam so pricing is insane. Yeah, I just... Like, I had modeled them, like... A friend of a, so there was a YouTube video months before those came out, kind of detailing the same thing. And a friend of mine, Fit, uh, Fish Max, Mace, you know John. Yes. Um, we had like played around with it a little bit and then just kind of abandoned it. Just like, I don't know, foams work really well for me right now and I just, they're easy and I like them and I don't know. One day I'll maybe try them. Karen Nallion says it's a first for me to see a pickle on a Bloody Mary. What? I've seen a fucking hamburger in a Bloody Mary before. Bacon, hamburger. I mean, you can drown all kinds of stuff in a Bloody yeah, Mary. The weather service is forecasting up to a foot of snow or more with winds gusting up 100 miles an hour through the weekend for the Big Island Summit. For the summit, okay. Nice, that's crazy. It is. There's only one hobby shop in the entire state of New Mexico. Really? Josh, are you ready to do a Friday night cross RC mammoth build? I may or may not have ordered one. No, I'm not. I was actually thinking this may be the last Friday night that I do with somebody else's trucks. Oh, I thought you were going to say no. me. I got so excited. No. Why? Just no. Because no. Not, not, not because I need more trucks to build myself. No. Just because I have so many other projects that I should finish that I could sell. You on board with that idea? Hmm? I don't care. You're... That was my argument for a mistress. How can I form an opinion unless I've tried one? <laughs> <laughs> Gunner says you suck. <laughs> yeah. Um, tell VP we need more gold wheel wheel options. Ah, uh, yeah, that definitely. I agree. Gold, all the gold wheels that you can sell, so you can get more. Yeah. What? I mean, that that part of the thought hadn't crossed my mind. I was just super excited that I thought he was going to say it was going to be a, the last Friday night. And then I was like, yes. That's not it, Josh. You just hate to ship. Yeah. Who's saying it? Oh, I should. Is that Sherwood? Oh, Brian, I shipped your body this week. It sat here for a month. Well, it's finally shipped. And you don't even. Because I shipped out that other truck that I. Remember that one I bought that night? Need more gold hundred spoke wheel options for sure. Hundred spoke. All the gold. What about polished chrome? Polished or chrome wheels, Josh? Whole different process. Not gonna happen. What's a good 90 millimeter shock option to replace the 100 millimeter shocks on the early Ford Bronco? Mm. There's a lot of 90 mils. I'm actually gonna put a set of... Uh, the new SC8s on that Capra. Just built all from parts. They'll be available in complete sets before too long. But for right now, I'm building a set up from parts to put under that truck. Um, picked up a VS410 Ultra from A-Main. I tend to crawl around streams and other wet conditions. Does Josh have any option? Opinions. Fuck, he has lots of opinions. On swapping out the black steel fasteners in the kit with stainless. Um, oh shit, I just realized it. Uh, so K and K makes a stainless kit, and I just realized again that one was sent with this truck. But I've continued to build with the non-stainless, the the ones that are included. I prefer the black screws that are included in the kit, but 
if you want a stainless kit, Team K and K makes a stainless screw kit. These are a painted hardware, basically. That's what's on here, and it it's, does pretty well with um, oxidation. So you can run the ones that come with it. I think you'll be pretty happy. But if you would like, pick up that K and K kit. Um, James, hopefully you're fine with the black. It's gonna look way better on the black edition anyway. Though I'm just saying. And it's a little bit stronger hardware. Eric Baker, is... thank you for the five dollars. Nicole needs to be auctioneer for your and Matt's live auction. Um... No, because she would just immediately go sold. <laughs> All right, what's next? Sold. Am I done? Make sure to you flex seal them axles on that ultra. <laughs> Do not you dare. Can the Traxxas tips be magnetized? The same set you have. I also ordered those with the Dewalt. I don't know that. I have not tried. Brian, thank you for the two dollars shipped. Now, what can I bitch about? <laughs> Keep them on his toes. Flex seal the tires. See, the problem is, it's like I'll, I'll get around to it. It's part of the agreement. Like for one, I don't. I have too many other things to care about to like super duper care. Like I'll get to it. Can't click on a video on YouTube without seeing that dang red cat lowrider hopping around for five seconds. Really? Before I can skip the ad. Oh. <laughs> get, get YouTube Premium. It's worth it. We don't have YouTube. We do. Why would you not tell me that? I want to make. I don't want you watching my YouTube account and screwing up all my. But I would like suggestions. To have it in small. Mm -mm. Can't have it. Do you think everyone should own an RC four wheel drive TF two? Do I think everyone should? No. <laughs> I always leave my tips on magnetic bowls. Always works well for me. Have you watched the RC review video about overdrive? No, but I don't know that he's my most trusted source for technical data. So well, you... I don't know that I'll have to see what it says. Do you have a video about overdrive? I believe so. Oh. But I believe that he also messaged us to try and understand it better. So I think Brandon <laughs> gave him some information, hopefully to clear things up, but you'll see. You mean yeet a TF2? Yeah. I, I think it's worth owning a TF2 just to... You can share the see premium them. plan with family members. Can you? Are you sure? I don't think that that... I think you're thinking of different... You're really good at eating that pickle. Did you just eat a pickle? I did eat a pickle. Nicole Designs, I would subscribe and dump this bowl. <laughs> <laughs> I've been trying to find a VP22 wheels in there. Out of stock everywhere. Any ideas when they may be back in stock? We're not producing 2.2 wheels currently. eBay. I just use my Allen drivers as storage for my rare earth magnets. <laughs> I have a stack of Neodynam magnets from failed body mount kit. Leave my driver on them. Huh. You can link her account with yours through YouTube. It's a family share thing. Because mm. I watch so much YouTube, it would be such an inconvenience for you. I guess maybe we can investigate that. I'm just you, saying you're going to screw up all my suggested content. Thank you, DK. I used a flat iron. Are you buying the WPL D42? Oh, I don't know. No. It, it does. It's appealing. You're not buying anything. I agree. I'd never. Would. It is Christmas. All of our money goes to toys. Exactly. Not adult toys. Children's toys. <laughs> Jimmy, two horses scored a set of blue tutu methods a few weeks ago. Ooh, there you go. There's yeah. a set of two twos on Facebook for four hundred dollars plus. Wow. Yeah. Maybe you should make them again. It's one of those things. Like two twos aren't that popular. One nines are way more popular, and we can only make so many wheels. So it's like, do you want to? We could make these and make a smaller percentage of people happy, or we could make more people happy by making the other parts. And so. You guys have Bluetooth drive shafts? <laughs> it's a it's like a card scene joke. Not 
like full size cars. Like, you know, SEMA trucks, the big stupid lifted ones. Yeah. Um, a lot of those trucks, they don't put a front drive shaft on. So people just call them Bluetooth drive shafts. Um, that's like it's not there. It's wireless. There's no such thing. Whole thing, right? Right. Get it? Funny joke? Not really. Agreed. There you go. T. Kaiman 270 said, join the Vanquish for Sale group on Facebook. They're always good stuff popping up for sale. Oh, yeah. That's definitely worth it to... Uh... Everyone should own a TF2 first, then buy a Vanquish product. It will all make sense then. <laughs> <laughs> RC World Drive does some things really well. And then other things, they don't do so well. Gladiator may have a Bluetooth drive shaft for a bit. Is that Ben? ben? Yeah. Ah, Ben bought new axles for his Gladiator. Cool. Where? You're not going off road. You don't need. I'm not buying new axles. I agree. What's so hard about overdrive? <laughs> BP isn't just a website. This is out of stock all the time. <laughs> Keeps you wanting more. I'm still waiting for a Vanquish truck with three tracks. <laughs> Um, Gunner, thank you for the ten dollars. Here's to the nephew's Christmas toy fund. Oh, thanks, thanks, Gunner. <laughs> you know how many times she's gonna use that? She's like, Gunner gave us ten dollars, and she's gonna use that on every gift. He wouldn't let me buy a mini trampoline. Like I already got a three foot trampoline, so now I need a seven foot trampoline for outside. Not for here, obviously. No, for no. Why would I buy? Toys for him here. He doesn't live here. All right. Why doesn't VP website show part numbers? Makes it a. It does if you're not on mobile. It's just uh, a different. So go on desk or just switch to desktop version. All the part numbers are there. Isn't it time to trade Jeeps? Who us? She doesn't go anywhere. That you know. <laughs> like I don't feel like I need to call you and let you know. I know when you leave. How do you know when I leave? I can see the tracks in the pavement. In the driveway. What, do you get back and then put all of the tree debris? Serves you right. Tree Serves you right. Tree A debris. bouncy house, I tried that too, but it was like $300, so. $300 for toys? That's ridiculous. Well, I mean, no, it's not. I mean... Let's be realistic. <laughs> but, like, I had already bought him a bunch of stuff, so that was why I couldn't. I'm just saying, if you ever spend $300 on toys, we're going to have a talking to. Okay. Okay. We had a conversation the other day about if you die, how much everything is worth. We did. And the spreadsheet and the whole thing. Yeah. Like, talk to me about... I didn't tell you what it was actually worth, though. You're going to have to find that out later when you find the spreadsheet. Is it old enough for an RC? He is um, probably old enough, but Josh doesn't know about the battery situation, or the electronic situation. What do you mean, I don't know? Oh, like, yeah. Like, for some, her brother is not an RC person. But he, and no, he would do it. He'd be fine. Would he, like, is he going to? Yeah. I'm just like trying, not trying to make a bunch of work for him. Not because I don't think he could do it. I obviously know he could do it. I'm just trying not to like make this whole thing every time he wants to do something. That if you're not an RC person already, like having that burden put upon you. Oh, whatever. He's three. You don't think that's a big enough burden as it is? That's why I'm not like. Oh, you want to go outside and play with something that I don't have to control? Okay. Here, plug in a battery. Like you're. Plug in a battery. Store batteries, charge batteries, buy new batteries. Never be worth more dead than alive, Josh. <laughs> I want to see Josh build a full-blown comp rig. <sighs> oh, Jeremiah says we just bought our boys bunk bed so we get to see who gets the top bunk. Oh, you're just going to let that one unfold just... on its own? Like, you're really just going to throw that one into the wild, huh? It's brave. I had bunk beds when I was little, but I had them for my, they're in my own room. <laughs> I had, I don't know why. I don't know why. Or when your friends came over? I guess. Is that a thing? I mean, if I had friends come over. Yeah. But like, it's just, yeah. Hmm. 
Um, hi from Salinas Valley Scalers. You just went, like you like you could have said hi. Oh, I, I I glitched. Sorry. Hello. <laughs> I was gonna say something. You I also, had a waterbed growing up. Me. You had a waterbed. From I went from a crib to a waterbed. That's why I'm so fucked up. That's why my body hurts so bad. Because I never had like mattress support. I just had a heater I could lay on. My brother did the same. He went. Well, I don't know when he got it. It wasn't at but. My brother is so cold blooded, he never slept with a sheet. Oh, he just laid, he just laid right on top yeah. of the plastic with the heater yes, cranked. Yes, that was the best. Like a psychopath. You could turn it up to a 10. It was he, the best. Yeah, he was he, on the side of the bed. It was like. Yeah, I remember this little dial thing. Look, one of those shitty timers. And he would just have that thing cranked. And then yeah. in the morning, he'd just peel himself off. <laughs> <laughs> like, what is wrong with you people? It was the best, though. No. Yeah. You know, I don't even know if you can buy water beds anymore. Probably not. It's probably a safety hazard. Brian Sherwood, thank you for the $2. Cut your losses, Josh. <laughs> Shh. Um, I, I know better than to think that she couldn't figure out what I'm worth. Oh, why would I do that? Yeah. I, I don't... She just knows if I die that she's going to have to pack stuff up Ugh. and move. And she's like, nah, not worth it. The only time I had a waterbed was when I had a nightmare. <laughs> I had a waterbed from the eighth grade to my late 20s. Those are Jimmy Two Horses. I mean, yeah, I had one, like, literally went from a crib to a waterbed. I don't. It's just That can't be that weird. That is weird, for one. Like. Your brother had one. Yeah, but my parents had one and he must have. Yeah, my parents had one too. He must have just been like, that's what I have to have. I mean. I don't know why, but. I mean, you're all weird, but. Cool. Don't wait on Josh. Get the nephew Spectrum Smart Bats Charger safe <laughs> and a TRX4 Sport Slow. Best aunt ever. Best aunt. Crib ever. to eighth grade. No, I had it like a crib till I moved out of the house when I was eighteen. You just said you had a crib until you were eighteen. No, a waterbed from a crib yeah. until I was eighteen. I had to pay five dollars more a month in rent living on a second floor in the eighties. Because you had a waterbed. Um, my uncle had one explode one time in an apartment. Oh my God. Yeah. My parents had a water bed with a mirrored top that I only recently understood. <laughs> <laughs> Josh, what are your thoughts on putting a VFD in a TRX4? I have one on the way to try it. Um, I mean, so just, be nice about it because you already ordered it. Yeah, yeah, it'll just be a matter of making it fit, like getting the, the skid plate to fit in there because you have to use the skid plate. Um, so like making it fit within the TRX4 chassis rails, it's going to be probably going to be a little bit of work. It might be difficult. Um, but if you can make it fit, then great. But it just might be difficult. I'm surprised I'm an only child. <laughs> <laughs> He's the one with the parents that had yeah. the well, yeah. variable frequency drive. I lived in an apartment that had no fish tank rule due to water damage. I lived there with a queen size water bed for four years. <laughs> yeah. Making fun of his brother on a water bed, yet he lost the top bunk to his imaginary friend. <laughs> I could have whatever bunk I wanted, whatever I wanted. <laughs> <laughs> And it was one of those ones that had the bottom, the the lower bed was like a queen. Yeah, so you could the, jump off the top. The top one was a full or, yeah. I don't know if it was a single and a full or whatever, but I don't think it was a queen. Probably not. But you can jump off the top onto the bottom. I mean, you would have had to like. But it was like. I was responsible. I was a responsible you're adolescent. You an asshole. Proline scalar shocks or Shrek's just big bore with low C springs. Um, I mean, the 
Proline ones are going to look more scale, but the Traxxas ones are going to perform better. The conversations that are happening in the chat. Are they good? Yeah. Okay, real question. What music do you and Josh listen to? What's in your playlist these days? I listen to uh, old school country. I listen to 2000s rap. <laughs> <laughs> And then some new school. Like I, I have the all the absolute trash music on my phone. Yeah. Like I have everything from like, like. I don't know. I have absolute terrible music on my phone. I have yeah. Paula Abdul and Justin Bieber and Dre <laughs> Chronic Two Thousand One and like <laughs> the whole range. Commissioner Baldy would like to know what do you think about the Pitbull Cronk. Chronic shocks? I've used oh, them before. They're a nice shock. He named something Chronic. Oh, my God. Yeah. <sighs> yep. Uh, they're, they're a good shock, actually. <laughs> <laughs> what? You guys are the weirdest couple musically. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Nicole's a shit kicker. Who knew? <laughs> Yeah, no, I have absolute trash music taste. It's so bad. It's, I have app Toto. Uh, stop, just stop, just don't, just don't. RC Blokes says hello from Australia. Love the show. We love you. Yeah. Um, What's just the... shut up. Just shut up. Stop talking about your music. It's so bad. Like, I'm so embarrassed for you. <laughs> Major Tom. Major Tom. That isn't even the right one. Like, <laughs> like, I. Yeah, like I'm literally embarrassed for you. Be quiet. <laughs> <sighs> Me and my old lady are the same. She listens to Christian, and I'm a death metal guy. Oh. Uh. Uh, I lost my overing on the SCX24 Outdrive. What would be a re good replacement? Um, no. Brr. No, I don't. Nothing is good about fucking Toto. You can't be mad listening to Toto. Africa. Yeah, I can't. I'm pissed every time it comes up on the fucking iTunes. I'm pissed. <laughs> That's because it was the first one since it, it was no. Africa. No. <laughs> so you get in the car and everything is. Dun, 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 dun. I hate it. <laughs> hate it. <laughs> <laughs> but I do love me some Paula Abdul. Oh, that's the worst one. Because you bought the whole Paula Abdul album. So I have to skip through like 50 different Paula Abdul shitty songs from the 90s. Um, Whatever, I like Paula Abdul. But no, mostly I'm... Like I walk down the aisle to Johnny Cash. He's my fave. <sighs> Nothing wrong with Dr. Dre at all. One nope. of my faves, along with the first album, Snoop Dogg. Yep. Wait, what? Weezer didn't write that song? <laughs> Weezer, like, covered um, everybody's. Oh, no, I'm thinking of Cake. Do you have a drag race car? I do. I put the skid plate in backwards. So, what kind of love idea. watching your video? I've got the uh, Undercover Drag Wings Renegade. It's a DR10 based. Um, can't believe I put the skate plate in backwards. I saw Weezer in concert too. You saw what? Well, Why? I I mean I can't understand concerts in general, but concerts are like a torture idea for me. That was a good one. What? Uh, the Folsom Prison album. I don't like Reba McIntyre. Oh. Me neither. Ah! I can't stand Reba. Hmm. Well, she drives well, me fancy? She drives me nuts. I thought fancy was Reba. Huh. Stupid. I mean Dolly's yeah. Cakes co covered Gloria Gaynor. They covered The Grateful Dead. I'm Guitar Man. Fancy don't let me down. Yeah. Oh, Tech yeah. Nine was from What? Kansas, Kansas City? City? Used to come through our high school parking lot and get thrown out CDs in their van. In the van? Yeah. They had like a van, you know, that they had like the shit on. They would come through our high school parking lot. This is before, I mean, I don't think it's before was. child protection laws. 
Concerts are where I, why I have hearing aids I don't wear. I love concerts. I just... I like music for when I'm doing something else. I'm just going to go stand there and listen. Like, it's just different. Just it's different. different? Different. It's more fun. Hmm. We have different ideas of fun. Well, I quit going to shows when I met you. So. I know, right? Alert you. You want to have real fun on a Friday night. <laughs> let let me let me show you something. Grant My first concert was Willie Nelson and Phil Lesh from The Grateful Dead. It, were you there willingly, or was that the one that you were at <laughs> that your mom always tells the story of? No, that was um, some kind of rock band. I don't know. <laughs> Mom, Mom always tells the story like you. We. I was nine months pregnant. <laughs> fucking concert. <laughs> and you were named after the waitress that they <laughs> that they had. <laughs> the aspirations that. <laughs> <laughs> she oh, was Scott really... Oblander saw the dead and at Starlight. That would be amazing. Starlight's the one in Kansas City. Yeah, ah, where go. I went all the time. Hmm. I can't remember. I didn't know if that was the one because they changed the name of it like every two years. That was not would not be Starlight. No, that was um, Sandstone. Oh, <laughs> never went to either of them. So. <laughs> Who brought you into RC cars? Myself, really. I just wanted an RC car. So I started doing a bunch of internet research and then found all kinds of stuff on the new this new type of RCing that was being discussed of rock crawling. I was like, that's going to be cool. I'm going to do that. It was before you could buy a rock crawler. You had to build it yourself. Oh, we've heard. Would you ever replace your VS410 Pro for a Phoenix for your go-to trail rig? I know where you live, Gunner. Um, I mean, they're pretty similar. Kerosene says, I saw Joan Jett and Hart at Starlight a couple years ago. I can't believe she refuses to be blessed by the rains. Fuck the rains. Fuck the that no rains down no. in Africa. <laughs> <laughs> that was my wake up alarm tone. Oh <laughs> my god, I hate you sometimes. <laughs> it's so bad. <laughs> so bad. That and like fucking Lady Gaga, like <laughs> would come on there. <laughs> and like a bad romance when I was talking to the vet on the phone in the car and it started playing and I was like I'm sorry my husband's an <laughs> asshole I don't know how that why this is playing right now <sighs> Emmons racing two dollars says do you hear it <sighs> <laughs> what's your favorite overall RC car truck ah uh. It's my, man, that's such a hard question. I can't answer it. I can't. I don't know how to answer that question. I don't know. I don't have a favorite. It's my, you always used to be my pro, and now I really like my Phoenix, and I just can't decide, and I like the better approach of the Phoenix body and all that, but oh I still God, like my pro so axles. Like right now. I'm, I'm about done. Wee, 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 wee. Really? Keep doing that. That helps me want to stay here so, so much <laughs> when you do that. When you make that noise. Right. There are very few times that I re like honestly want to punch you in the face, but that is one of them. That's one of them? Yeah. Yeah. It's not time to put the shocks on yet, but it is time. We're not going to fill these shocks with oil for now. Yeah. Emmons Racing, thank you for the two dollars. These 
one. Oh, this is for our link building. Just need a new drink. That is true. Baby shark alarm, Nicole. I mean, I do Low blow. I would, I like baby shark. Except for my nephew's son, or my nephew's name is Emmett, so I sing baby Emmett, 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 baby Emmett, and he always goes, no, baby Coco. He's my favorite. I love him. Stabby Josh, thank you for the $3 for some random reason. <laughs> For some random reason. Thank you. Hear and watch Lady Gaga and Tony Bennett on YouTube. No, I would never diss Lady Gaga. Like, I am I think she's fabulously talented. Like, I think she's an amazing singer. But. I just don't like that song that, the bad face. romance song. Yeah. But no, I love, but I think she's fabulous. Like. Um, she's it's just not my type of music like we used to package each of these links into with individual sizes and it took so many bags we've changed how we do that why because it also is very expensive to use as many bags lady dog all won me over with the knee dress no i think she's great i think she's incredible um, you just didn't like listening to the same song yeah, when you got in the car? Yeah. I think that's what ruins a lot of it for people. Yeah. When it's just that same song. When you song. plug your phone in and you're just like, oh, I'm going to listen to a podcast. And then it's like, ah! like, ah! <laughs> ah! James Knight is here. What's up, James? The earth thanks you. Anything from you. Never going to run around, going to run around. Um... The longer you guys talk about bands, the younger I feel. What RC car do you like to drive the most? I mean, up to this point, like my Pro has always been kind of my go-to one. Just because it's got a portal axle in the rear and it's got my straight axle in the front. And I've put so many crazy miles on it and I like the way it looks. And I just was so comfortable with it. But over yes. the last year, I've really driven my Phoenix the most. Josh Thompson, yes. You guys do all the packaging of kits and parts in house. Um, mostly. Mostly. There's some. There's a lot of things that come like pre-kitted for us now, um, and then the Phoenix is done out of house just because that was the whole point of that, trying to get the cost down. I wish someone would explain Billie Eilish. That shit is catchy. It is catchy. I don't have any Billie Eilish on my phone though. Um, I just bought it on Beat Saber on the. I bought her whole album on Beat Saber. Did you? Yeah, I haven't played it yet though. But yeah. my um. What was the song I just... 14-year-old cousin told me that it's worth it. Because I was like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to buy this. Like, I don't like spending money on this stupid Oculus thing. And she was like, no, it's totally worth it. She's like, what's your favorite Oculus game? I'm like, Beat Saber. She said, oh my god, me too. <laughs> did you feel cool and young? I did. <laughs> <laughs> she texts me every day at 5 o'clock. <laughs> um... Because she knows you'll be in bed shortly after? <laughs> no, well, it's 7 o'clock there. <laughs> so 5 o'clock here. Um, and so I, she texts, you know, I have to find something to talk about because... Because you have to relate to a 14-year-old? Yeah, like, oh, I hated school so much. Like, I didn't want to be there. I never went. I can't say things like that, like how I really feel about it. So I have to... Right. Yeah. Like, you don't really have to finish in school, like... Just really rack it. <laughs> like no one even questions a good enough degree. <laughs> Promise. <laughs> <laughs> We're getting to my favorite part of a build where I've got to assemble links. Do you want to go make me another drink? You want me to make it? A re no, make it reasonable. Don't make me cringe. Here, my Salberg. Thank you for the five dollars. Can you read that? I can. Do you think I could find two TRX4 Sports for 500? Also, the Gummy Bear, the Gummy Bear song, the most annoying song I ever made. I've never heard the Gummy Bear song. Two TRX4s for 500. I think you could if you find them close to stock used. Um, because for some reason, what? Yes, please. Because um, otherwise, some people can think that their TRX4 Sports are worth way too much money. Um, Mainly because of all of the brass they put on them. 
but that is, you know, that is the reason. Nicole, add an extra big pickle for John. Oh, okay. I almost she almost forgot the pickle. I would trade my VS410 Pro for two Phoenixes, a downgrade quality. I would not trade my VS410 for two Phoenixes. I mean, you're talking about a difference between, you know, metal axles and not like the VFD, the, the standard VFD transmission is, is a beast. So, but you know, you get dig out of the box, which is huge and it works fantastic. Um, then you get the shiftable overdrive too, which is an awesome, an awesome thing to, to add. Uh, I really like the new inner fenders we did in the front, that hard molded plastic, um, cool piece, you know, the, the, uh, Lex and inner fenders is one thing that I've gone through plenty of with my VS410 pro. And so, so many rod ends to put pivot balls in. Don't be a brassle, exactly. <laughs> oh, because I'm an island boy. That's a goddamn song. I don't know if Nicole has seen that. Uh, the lap dance is always the better. It's always better when the stripper. Oh my god! Shouldn't have read that whole th thing out loud. <laughs> didn't no, I didn't read it all out loud. There you go. Um. I'd buy a Phoenix if I could find one. Yeah, I know. Uh, obviously, they sold faster than we expected, but more are coming. Um, and there's a chance that they'll be here for Christmas, but it might be after. Well, we shall see. We can only do what we can do. So now we've got to assemble all these things. Link tools. Ah, this one doesn't work with the bent rod end. It's okay. I can grip it. What KV would you recommend for the Phoenix on 3S? Uh, 23 to 2700 is my kind of preferred range right now. I used to run a lot more like 3100s, 3000, 3500 range, but um, I've been going to 2700s mainly now. And because uh, then I can run them on 3S or 4S and be happy. I think I have a 2300 in mind right now. It might be, I can't remember exactly, but, and then that way I can run on four, three or four S. And so. What song has to be Barbie girl? Who sang Barbie? Go. Links, links, links. Uh, I think we should make salt axle monster truck builders kit. Yeah, Aqua, that was who it was. That's right. I knew it was like a one hit wonder song. So many links to load. The worst song ever is posted on Josh's Facebook. I don't know what you posted on there, Brian, but is it awesome by Spose? Cause I'm awesome. My ex roommate had the most eclectic of music choices. Hmm. <laughs> What's that blue tool uh, in your hand? It is called a Zerba tool. And it is a tool that I use all the time. The other one is a TGH rod end tool, Team Garage Hack. Runs in your drill. And you put one rod end in one side. And then you put the other one in the Zerba tool. And you just drive them both in. And you have assembled links. It makes link building go so much faster. 
<laughs> no, you're not, dude. Don't lie. <laughs> Met all my friends online. <laughs> That's it. Did you make it like a human? Look at what you, you put a green bean in there even. Oh, I had green beans. Look at you all fancy. I just washed my hands because I put a jalapeno here. Oh, did you put a lot of Tabasco? Thank you. What is that tool called? This is the, it's called a Zerba tool and it's spelled, get ready, write this down, get your phone out, get the text started. S Z C Z E R B A. Zerba tool. And this is the Team Garage Hack Rod End tool. No celery? I didn't have any celery. Yeah, celery is the best thing for. Oh, well, I'm sorry. To... But we don't have celery in the house normally. Um, I do because normally, but then it no one eats it. So it goes, so I put a green bean in it because we actually, I eat green beans raw out of the bag. So. Yep. And yeah, there's another pickle in it. Did you try it? Not yet. Whoa. That was a lot. Come on. Think about it. But if you hate building links or build as many links as I do, these are great tools to invest in. Yeah. What are you going to rotate the one quarter tool clip on your DeWalt? Josh got a wet salad. <laughs> that Bloody Mary needs some arm again. Ooh, that's a good idea. I should have put a piece of dirt in it. That's a good idea. Do you want some? We're not cooking on the bread. Either. That's a great idea. Jerky is a fantastic Bloody Mary accoutrement. Oh my God, you ate that whole box? <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I, no, 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 I didn't. Your parents took some for the plane ride, remember? No. <laughs> Josh, did Nicole come as a kit or an RTR? Um, he was, <laughs> oh, okay. found her on the used market. <laughs> Ouch. You can find the best deals there. I'm kidding. You were brand new. <laughs> exactly. Try it. Hey, Try it. Here. Hey, I was 24 years old when you met me. What? Is that human enough? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Eat shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is good. You did a good job. And there's an olive in there? So good. Well, there's a, a, and a jalapeno, and jalapenos. Hmm. But there's a toothpick as well. So tasty. Josh, you're about to get yeeted. <laughs> um, what's an Applebee upgrade? An Applebee upgrade? I don't know. Uh, did she come with a receiver? <laughs> Oh, yes. Sriracha bacon jerky to a few bars I used it in Bloody Mary. Classy. <laughs> what can I say? Do my best. Cheers. Cheers. That's very good. Huh. You did such a nice job. <laughs> I think Nicole's just cleaning out the fridge and calling it a Bloody Mary. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was like, what do I have? I almost went and picked out a key lime off the tree and put it in there, but I will. Yeah, I don't blame you I for just, not doing that. Yeah. Like, nah. Where did you get the stick pack? Stick pack? Has a hand test been done? I don't know. Have, no, it's not. There's no wheels on it. There's no, you can't do Are that. Are you talking about me? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. My favorite and old trapper teriyaki beef sticks and the cherry maple flavor from the jerky store in Gatlinburg. Gatlinburg, you know Gatlinburg. I do. I, I don't. Gatlinburg. I've not been to Gatlinburg. Cheapy, come here. He was just in here yelling. Look at all this bubble wrap. 
that is already topped. What? How is this flat bubble wrap? You just call it flat? Yeah, no, it's all popped already. Like it lost its carbonation? Um, has Josh found the end point? <laughs> is that about me? It's, I mean, it's an RC joke, but I think. Because <laughs> <laughs> there's no money. Tennessee is a must, but it is. If we you guys love Tennessee. Cause Nicole to kill Josh. I call Dib <laughs> Tripper. Fancy song upgrade Oreo shake bourbon. Oh. All right, new game. Things you can say about your RC car that you can say about your spouse. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. You huh? Didn't keep my first one. <laughs> Just the right amount of bounce. She's electric. Plug and play? <laughs> Maybe a tight fit now, but it should loosen up. <laughs> I went bigger, two twos. <laughs> <laughs> and then I put my stick pack. Oh, my <laughs> wife has Bluetooth boobs. <laughs> Loose connection. <laughs> you should have seen her when she was new. <laughs> <laughs> These inserts aren't as firm as they used to be. Looks good when you clean it up. <laughs> Is there grease in there? <laughs> oh man, there's some wheels spinning. <laughs> There's a lot of people who aren't, <laughs> whose wives aren't watching this with them. Yeah, that rear end makes more noise than it used to. <laughs> when it was new, it was tight. Oh, are these nuts tight enough? <laughs> Is she bind and drive? Get the flex seal. <laughs> Josh, how do you keep from not spitting out your drink when reading a funny comment? <laughs> Found this one on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> Jesse says slowly backing out of this I got memes for this <laughs> <laughs> this is fabulous the rear end is all worn out needs replaced she's got some road rash but she still runs <laughs> not that once you shake the fruit flies off <laughs> got this one in a trade <laughs> Tightener slipper cut clutch found it on ebay time to upgrade Slight used and a bit rough, but she's mine. <laughs> Paid five hundred dollars for this one. <laughs> what happens when her foams get wet? <laughs> oh man, these diffs are tighter than first built. <laughs> uh, that was funny. Okay, everyone hit enter and be done with this joke. <laughs> <laughs> I've got others I can run. <laughs> I always lose money when I get rid of them. <laughs> She'll still hunt. <laughs> oh, sh who said that? She'll still hunt? <laughs> I was going to say, that's a Midwest term. Yeah. There. Like, I know that one. That dog will still hunt. Yeah, that dog And still now hunt. things you can say about your RC car that you can't say about your spouse. <laughs> She's leaking a lot more than she used. You bought for 50 but got to pay five large to get out. Daily driver or shelf queen? <laughs> I always need to new shoe. Oh, my brother gave me this one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Anything your brother, any girl your brother has is way out of your league. <laughs> Can't beat that new car smell. You have links and shit back there. Did you I have know links back there? Yeah. On the ground? Yeah. Huh. Lost in shipping. <sighs> <laughs> And get them cheaper out of China. <laughs> <laughs> Cost you more in the long run. <laughs> I prefer to beat up a borrowed one than my own. Gunner. <laughs> yep, 
she came with spare parts. She likes a dig and four on the floor. Technically, Nicole was lost in shipping. Don't be like true and smash it off a curb. <laughs> Is there a return policy? <laughs> Got this one mail order from Russia. Um, I was lost in shipping. Rejected in shipping. Yeah. She's been passed around Craigli Craigslist a few times. <laughs> I can't get it. That's fine. I have more. Ugh. <laughs> Ad says only one other. <laughs> like Tower Hobby, she's still on the easy payment plan. <laughs> Drive it like you borrowed it. RC girl removed her grill cover too soon. What? Oh, that's a... I'm... I mean, I don't know if that's in response to this joke, but that's an actual thing. Oh. The FD twin release date. Uh, it's already released. It's on the uh, Phoenix. No. Separately, I have no idea. Used to have firm suspension, but now she's full droop. Oh. oh. I play with mine by the hour. What is the, what did R RC girl remove her grill cover? Yeah, like on an RC car. I think. I don't know if they were trying to make a joke that applied, but. There was a RC for old drive thing and mine likes bind and drive. She's a shelf queen. Right. On my next video, I'll take her to top off and clean her undercarriage. <laughs> oh man. It's almost eight o'clock. Things are a little loose, but I still like driving it. We're getting there. Just. Mine has patina. That's nice. She rattles like grandma's teeth. Time to put into overdrive. Hey, just, I need to, I just need like an RC wives version of this. We can talk about all of us dumbasses. Yeah. <laughs> Just Rock RC said this sucks. Came down with COVID and then decided watching the stream tonight to buy a pro. <laughs> <laughs> well, hey, I'll give you something to do. Yeah. Sorry. Hope you're good. I know you Safe don't recovery. like the place, but what would be a good tire to run at Deer Creek? Um, I mean, the only tire that I ever ran there was crawlers. So, and they did fine. We tested the uh, VFD there the, with the VS410 Pro. Like, that was one of our early testing places. Had a grand old time. It's just a little, little needly for me. When was the last time Josh finished a build in one night? Is that one of those things that oh, no, the RC wives would say? <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely hard to finish all one of these all in one night as far as like on a stream i got this one because i like crawling <laughs> i like that but nicole it wouldn't be any fun attacking such easy targets no sport in it for you <laughs> yeah. i think you know what i think she'd still have fun oh yeah yeah is there a trick to straighten a four-wheel steer rig without rear trim or adjustable arms is there a trick to it? Um, just, sorry, where is that? Is there a trick to straighten a four wheel steer rig without rear trim or just one? Um, I mean, if your radio doesn't have sub trim, you're talking about like setting it initially, that's going to be difficult, but you should have sub trim. There's a big cleanup day out there tomorrow with crawling after. Will they take the mattress that's in my garage? <laughs> Do have a mattress in our garage that needs to get ditched anybody anybody second no native anybody she has some bolt-ons would the rc wives include pics of them on dryers and camo bikini <laughs> Duh. <laughs> with like everything every amazon box that i have like in the background like all the trash there's none in. I took them all today. I know. That's what I'm. I'm just saying. Oh my God. Hey. Squints, Pelidors. <laughs> Bring to the shop for the homeless. 
Right. Hit that like button. Thank you. Phoenix and D Davis ism. Hey. Uh, oh my God. Hey. What are you doing? What's up, Sokums? <laughs> I got my camo on these on. Let's go. I mean. What? I just, yeah. Oh, so he's in your box. Sorry, Jimmy, two horses for the cat hair. <laughs> it is a bloody mare. They aren't called homeless. They're called employees, Josh. <laughs> Mattress removal for a Phoenix test drive. Ha ha, making a dump run Sunday. Robbie, you can, <laughs> you don't even have to take a mattress if you really want to come Phoenix test drive. Fuck. I think I need to go film this weekend somewhere. Well, I've got two. Robbie can take my mattress. I'm guessing Nicole would be saying worse or the same if not on this stream. I mean, there's yeah, nothing. She happened. doesn't ship. She doesn't fill. <laughs> here's a here's a quick tip. She doesn't filter herself much for this stream, no. no matter how much I ask. You can fuck off or not have me on it. <laughs> Your mom was saying, she was like, I never watch you guys live because I feel like it's weird. And I'm like, there is nothing I would say on here that I would never say, that I wouldn't say in front of you. She's like, oh, I know. <laughs> oh, I, I've heard. <laughs> I'm like, but for real. Looking, I'm like, I love when you watch live. Everyone loves it. Looking for a new four channel radio. Any suggestions? Uh, for four channel, I still run my four p.m. That's still kind of one of my. That's still kind of my go-to radio, oh. really. I just drop. I don't. It's sucky. No, I didn't drop a cat. Nicole would fit right in down in New Zealand. That's where my co I have a cousin whose wife is from New Zealand. She's my favorite. Drinking bloody beers and green olives. <laughs> Nicole, filter equals zero hot, just the way we like it. Um, thank you, Squints, for the five dollars. Hashtag no filter. <laughs> Even though in my head it's still pound sign. <laughs> Josh, Nicole's much more interesting on Fridays. Sorry, Josh. My wife wants to know if Nicole would be at the scale Nats in April. Um, it's a possibility, but we'll have to see. That's in Alabama. Oh, fuck yeah, I'll be there. Matt's going. Okay, so you have a girlfriend the whole time. I don't care. <laughs> like, <laughs> I don't care. Oh, what happened? What'd you do? I, I literally did not touch anything. I don't believe you. Josh. Did it clear all that out? Yep. I literally did not touch okay. anything. I believe you. Totally believe you. You can rewind it. <laughs> not how that works. Wow. Well, I don't know what to say but yes i will be i keep me away from fucking the vast capital of the world crappie capital crappie capital of the world. keep me try and keep me away from alabama nicole does love gadsden she's nicole, been there before for my wife will bring you alcohol i feel like this is going to become an issue at all like we've been we did this we started this during the pandemic so we haven't been to a lot of events since but i feel like now that i'm on here like people think i drink a lot more than i do like, <laughs> like i swear to god i only drink on friday nights <laughs> if there's a stream if there's not a stream we just and then we just go to bed early like you go to bed early. well I'm, I'm i go out partying <laughs> Work. You go out party with yeah. ew, with Gunner yeah. in Lodi. Cool. We could. We could. I'm tempted to drive out to Alabama. Come to Tuscaloosa. All right. Tuscaloosa, Alabama. We can fly into Cleveland, Ohio. What did we do? last time we went? We flew. Oh, into I was in Nashville already. Oh, that's right. I picked you up on the way. Yeah, you and Aaron, like a Big Aaron, street walk. You and Big Aaron <laughs> drove down, and we you drove. You spent the night in Nashville, and then. We went out, we went and did everything in Nash. like, we did a bunch of stuff in Nashville, and then we drove down to Gadsden. Gadsden, Alabama. Yeah. But seriously, I have Sublime stuck in my head now. Cleveland. Oh. 
<laughs> so you're only drunk on Friday night. I mean, yeah, honestly. Like, mm. I... Yeah. Like... <laughs> Oh, somebody gave us their online name. There you go. What's that mean? I don't know. I'm assuming it's spam. Oh, someone <laughs> someone block, block them? Why? I mean, unless someone's looking for a date. Oh, I know. All these people are like, date. I got a date on the live stream. Got a date for scale gnats. <laughs> 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 when we were there the last time was... 2014 for US RCCA uh, I nationals. Think, I think it was and we had all the Japanese there. Mm. And we went to Walmart and they had the the meat. They were like, USA. Like they were posting pictures of the meat yeah, we freezer were at, on at Facebook. Walmart. And they were like, USA. And they had told their wives that they were on traveling business. on business like in other places in Japan. Yeah, they were like, yeah, you know, we're just in Japan. They told their wives they were literally just on a work trip, but in Japan. They're in Alabama they in the United awesome. States. It was a lot of fun. They were awesome. They were, and like, they were awesome. I mean, we had, those guys, those days we were a little bit more into drinking. <laughs> Actually, not so much because we had a house by then. Uh, yeah, we were still we still partied a lot, I think. But th nothing compared to the Japanese, we did not stand a chance. Or the Australians, or the Canadians. <laughs> French Canadians. Oh wait, there was both. They were fighting. They were fighting. They didn't like each other. But I mean, like in a good way. <laughs> yeah, in the most Canadian way possible. Right. You said Bama like Forrest Gump. Greenbow, Alabama. Speaking of dates, where's Alex? Thank you. That's that's what's going to I think he has a girlfriend. I got the number from live chat. Is the same as she gave me her number. No. <laughs> no. That drink looks delicious. I might need to go shopping for Bloody Mary Green tomorrow. Is Alex on a date? Let's talk about that. You probably met someone at Comic Con. Uh, you, Comic Cons don't just happen all the time. What? Like, do they happen all the time? We would have known if he was traveling for one. Or is Alex getting drunk with friends? Oh. Uh, mm hmm. He's left us. Will you do a video when the new 2022 Sorka rules get posted? Um, sure. Do you give a fuck about Sorka rules? Well, Scale Nationals is Sorka. I gotta give a, a F if I'm gonna build trucks to the rules so I can beat Matt. Perry G's here. Hi, you are late. You're super late. And what's this about Alex in a date? I don't know. Un unfounded slander. Of our friend. Yes. And original mod. To move there and start a private practice. Why? No clue. Move where? Phoenix. Funny. Oh, I love Tennessee. We'll retire. We love Tennessee. We'll retire in the Smokies. If you need a rescue call in case the day's going badly, call him live during the stream. Nicole. <laughs> Alex, are you okay? <laughs> Blink twice. If you need a, if you need me to start crying. I want 100 plus acres in the middle of nowhere. Won't have to worry about the sketchiness. <laughs> Gunner's trying to move to Tennessee. Yeah, he's been talking about it. Good for you. Get the fuck out of California. Alex also likes to take breaks from the internet or falls asleep in his chair, says Jesse. With his cat. Like, if his cat sits on him, he's just like, well, I guess I can't move. I have to go to sleep now. Uh, Like, you... I like how you say that like that's not exactly what you do. What? That I thought we were Alex's steady Friday night fling pouting. <laughs> um you're like, oh I'm sorry, the cat's holding me down. I can't get up. I mean The longer I'm in California, the less I like people. Amen, Arthur at Eastridge. Amen. L -l less he likes what? People. Oh, just in general? Yeah. Oh sure. I thought 
everyone was the same until I moved to California. And I was like, no, people are like legit assholes. <laughs> A hundred plus acres plus skinwalkers. That that is only in Nevada. That's not anywhere. Babe. There's <laughs> like we'll watch a documentary and you'll believe it. They can just call they can call anything a documentary. You know that, right? But it's for real. Mm. It's real. God damn it. Do you wanna watch it? No. It's called The Hunt for the Skinwalkers. Really good. Um, local groups talking about doing a 124 scale comp. What would you suggest would be a good ready to run? Uh, I mean, SCX 24 is your best bet to start and then go from there with upgrades and yada, yada, yada. But there's a group here that's doing them as well. Um, that sounds even dumber than 10 scale comps. <laughs> I mean, it's something to do Josh, with. Josh, you can't prove it's not real. I live in Murphy. But you can't Tennessee, prove it's real either. Tennessee, come on. People have seen it. They're like old dudes. They're not fucking on acid or something. Like, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Murfreesboro is fantastic. It's. You know, go dig a hole at Skinwalker Ranch and see if you don't get sick. What does that have to do with anything? I have no idea. I've never even heard that before. But <laughs> there can't just be stuff in the ground that makes people sick. The what's wrong with you people and you? <laughs> More torque. When did the Vanquish Looper come out? This thing is amazing. Ripper came out. Uh, good night. Thank 2017. You I called him Count Solid. Did you ever? Did you answer his question? Yeah, SX24. Uh, how many? How many fucking 24 skill things are out there? Are there mm. a lot? Yeah. Ugh, so annoying. Never seen a baby pigeon, but I know they exist. Hashtag Team Skinwalker. Y'all need Jesus. Y'all need Jesus, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Update us that just tuned in. Did Banquet release limited black edition? No, this is a new old stock. NOS. Not no sense. What? It no. They what? did, but it was back in a while ago. What? What? That's not a complete thought. What do you mean they did, but a while ago? You guys did a black edition. This. But a while ago. It was a limited release, but a while ago. Wall? A while ago. Abuse. A while ago. Thank you. Okay. We, that's... Do you have any 187 scale RCs? No. <laughs> No, what did I have? A 136 or something. Baby pigeons don't exist because birds aren't real. Wake up, people. <laughs> <laughs> birds aren't real is an awesome movement. I, I know that is funny as shit. <laughs> <laughs> I just like that he said that. Like, wake up, people. I approve as well. Where'd the other axle go? There it is. Let me know when you head to Folsom. I'll bring some stuff. Who? Gunner. Gunner. We'll do. I, oh, I messaged Gunner there last time and he was like, I'm going to do something more fun. Like, whatever. There was a documentary on Skinwalker Ranch where several people standing there claimed to get sick after digging. Were they digging near a septic tank, maybe? Oh, birds are robots. The lockdown was so they could change the batteries. <laughs> <laughs> Take that ripper off the shelf, send it to me, and you will be saved. Says Brian. Is it ripper, Brian? The earth is. There's back. no ripper on the shelf. Where'd it go? I need to know. Where is it? Is it on the spreadsheet? Yep. Where's it at? Oh, hi, thank you. My ripper is going to oh, drop. Oh, no. Just drop our seat. 
Definitely accidentally named my kitten Vanquish. Me, a Phoenix RC crawler, were talking one night and she started responding to it after our conversation. <laughs> Nicole, I just realized it's been so long since I've seen you guys. Crawl for a cure. My hair has gone from Josh's length to yours. Oh, wow. <laughs> Why does... That's Perry G. Why does my brand Axial Capra for WS not move in reverse? Haven't even ran it. First time talking um, in. Want to roll off table as well as powering on help. Uh, there's a little, there's these little like dip switches for black. There's actually a little black thing on the top of the ESC. You should be able to just, there should be a thing that says forward reverse and it sh the pin should be on that setting. They probably just got set incorrectly at the factory. Glamis with a hundred thousand horsepower sand rails is more fun than Folsom. I don't even know what that is, but it is way more fun than Folsom. Glamis is a location, sand dunes. What, a thousand horse? I saw a thousand horsepower and I was sold. We have a video on the Ripper. It's a machining piece of art. I do have a, I do have one. A thousand horsepower. I'm down. My dream lime green VS four ten is gone from the rack behind you. No. No, it's it's just behind Nicole. She's blocking it. Cheeky tin. Oh, big buddy. He weighs twice as much as Sookie. Yeah, he does. He's 16 pounds already? No. 15? Yeah, 15, 14 pounds? She's seven. Sorry, Josh, but I still think the Origin is the best full kit ever made, says Ryan. It was very nice. It was just very expensive to make. Where are you going? Where are you, where are you going? Hi, Bubba's. The Origin with a VFD is honestly one of the best. You're such a big purr. You're such a big purr. You good boy? So good. What you got? It's more like a trillion duck power. <laughs> Let's talk low budget. How's the Gen 7? Ooh, not a fan. Low budget, go SCX 10 2. You can get them cheap. Way better car. Young big boys will stay at 18 and 20 pounds. I think he has so. I think I think that's where Chief will end up. Yeah. He's seven months now, eight months? I know, he's almost a year. Hmm. But I'm a big boy. Don't step in that grease. Oh yeah, let's uh let's put that cap on. Yeah. Oh he always he licks all the glasses. All the glasses. What's up, buddy? What you doing? I go to Glamis every Thanksgiving. You guys are welcome to come along. Goats and whatever, and a thousand horsepower, that's all I need. Say no more. I'm there. A, a thousand horsepower is cool, but 3,000 horsepower is God. Oh, he has a pixie bob and a tuxedo. It's a big old tuxedo. Oh, you're talking about cats. I was just like, I was like, that's a. What it, I was like, that's a weird outfit. Like Pixie Bob and a <laughs> No, a Pixie Bob is like a bangle, but a bobcat. Oh. Yeah. Good morning from Malta, 5 a.m. Grip Customs. Fabulous. I, Good why morning. are you up so early? One Lacos is here. Hey, How's hey. your wife? Hopefully she's recovering from that surgery that I also remembered. Good job, babe. Thank you. How's the raccoons? Josh needs to pee outside again. They're not there anymore. Yeah, they are. They are. There's fresh shit outside. They're, yeah. I don't oh, it. cheapy tins. You're so sweet. This is the sweetest guy. Going to get the Gen 7 portal axle kit. Maybe it will perform a bit better. My buddy. Met my wife on a trip to Glamis. I don't know what. Was she there with somebody else? Yeah. How'd you meet her there? My extra toad Hemingway cat is going to be what the fuck when the rig comes back. Yeah. <laughs> it's a peridactyl. Extra toad? Yeah, when they have six toes, it's called peridactyl. I have no idea why I know that. I've never had a peridactyl cat in my life. Um, good boy. Such a good boy. You need some waddle? You're so sweet. Yes. But yeah, he is a big boy. 
I'm a big boy. Oh, such a good boy. I love you. This Cheeto doesn't even get flies. I They played with a fly for 20 minutes today. He was screaming at the top of his lungs at it. And it finally landed on the blanket and was injured, so I smashed it. But they, they play with a fly. They don't kill a fly. He is not, yeah, he is not a hunter. No. Sookie is kind of a hunter. Yes. He has a hunting instinct. I don't know if she's... Wife's healing well. Been getting her outside as much as possible. All right. That's good. So you can stop. Nicole knows the car that... Because she has six to... Oh, I... Oh, cheapy. Cheap off good. the monitors. Josh, set up my buddy and his girl. His girl and mine work together. Ah. Baby talking to cats is a bad sign. Is a what? Bad sign. That's Phoenix. Like, we've met. You're fine. <laughs> like, it's not. I like, promise. Like, it's a sign of you're crazy? Is that the is that what they're saying? No. Uh, hi, Nicole, Joshua, and all. I'm glad I'm catching the last of the live feed. Thank you, Slow Dawn, for knowing it's the last of it. <laughs> it is 8.15, so. <laughs> what modifications would have to be done to make a Spectrum 2-in-1 motor system fit into the Phoenix? I heard Matt was talking about it in his review video. Um... So the Spectrum 2-in-1's a little fat, and you have to shave a little bit of the front upper link mount. What'd you do? You spill? Yeah, I did. Not a lot, though. You see yourself? You Does see that power driver have adjustable torque setting? It's got a big old jalapeno. Yes, it does. Right here. Cat and I had cat I had when I was a kid would catch my spring into the front door until someone came out, and then he'd kill it and eat it. That was nice of him for it to wait. We had the greatest Morris cat until it started to hate Sue. Then every day it would shit on her pillow. She found him a good home. <laughs> what? Every day? We had a peridactyl tuxedo cat when I was young. We called him Thunderpaws. Thunderpaws. <laughs> That's awesome. Ex-roommate had a polydactyl named Seven. What's up, buddy? You can't have it. Suck. You're fine. Come here. Go. She's just yelling at me. She doesn't want to see you. She's like, cheap play? Is there cat hairs in your drink? Probably. Most likely. 100%. But I live with Josh, so. Oh, oh. Phoenix, you're so cute. Okay, now you've seen the cat's butt. Hit the butt turn on. <laughs> you're so cute. I love him. There's a DeWalt without the clutch. Make yes. sure you don't buy that one. Exactly. That's I'm just gonna stand here right in the hardware tray. Yeah. It's, it's... Every day he loved our son. Sue, not so much. That Bloody Mary was missing some cat ass. <laughs> oh, he's stepping on shit. Such a dickhead. Not as much as Suki. Do you have any scale trailers? Nope. Not a big trailer fan, personally. Oh, wait. I have a semi-truck. Yeah. That, but it's a computer inside. Mm, it's huge. It and is Matt huge. sent his to the guy. Mine's going there as well. When? It's not like it's in your way right now. No. All of this is in my way. Is it, though? Like, I could have a Pilates room. I mean, you could, but what would get used more? My Pilates room. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ow! Don't, don't. <laughs> Stop. Ow! Sookie the Servo Destroyer. Oh, that's right. What if it was a live axle trailer idea? Oh, fucker. Did that hurt? So, yeah. <gasps> I know. So it's for <laughs> Cheapy. That hurts. God. I'm sorry. I won't do it. Don't. <laughs> Is a Phoenix more versatile than the Element Enduro? I mean, more versatile. It's got more features, and I think that it's better built, but it's more expensive. Hello. So. We're part of all of this, Miss Thing. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> what new machines are Vanquish buying for the shop? A big one. Oh, Russ Walkers, thank you for your help. I'm headed to bed to get in the woods early tomorrow. That's like hunting. Mm -hmm. switch, in, switch to a Vanquish studio. That room can be Nicole's. No, I like to be at home. Now. I would rather him be at home. Wouldn't we? We'd rather him be at home, wouldn't we, Chief? And it's much quieter here. Yeah. Get the driver with two batteries, says Brian. Yep. The two battery and a charger combo is the way to go. Oh, thank you for licking my cup. He's a loser. He's got crudes in him. Whoa. You little shithead. Our polydactyl cats have seven toes on front and five toes on rear. Horrifying seeing all the... Yeah. No. No, you can't chew on that. No. Hey. Hey. He's chewing on it. No. Hey. You That's little not... shithead. No, baby. I know. It looks like fun, but it's not. Definitely funny when Nicole abuses him. Should try and snag that chair lover again in a bit. Is it to build the R2? This show would be incomplete without the both of you. <laughs> Matt does a great job. I mean, I've never, like, watched it, but I assume. <laughs> I mean, all of the shows that have other people besides me are my best ones, that's for sure. I mean, Josh, I spoke with your CNC machine rep at RC Country a while back. You guys have nice equipment. I-A-R-C, says Perry G. Yeah, we do have. If I recall, yes. Huh. Cold or cutting dirt later, Josh? Oh, it's baller. <laughs> New release suggestion. SCX6 contender Vanquish BS6. Oof. That would be... Um, Honestly, I mean, Horizon did a hell of a job with that thing. That just because... Thing about me somehow accidentally drunk dialing him. Not drunk dialing. Drunk FaceTiming. And I have no idea how. Because you were in Missouri. I was in Kansas. I was at home. And I accidentally FaceTime. For some reason, Brian, ball, big baller, RC crawler. Um, I And he was like, he FaceTimed him and he's just like... He, no, he. you know what he said? Well, we both have clothes on, so this is awkward. <laughs> and I was like, God damn it. And then she texted me or called me right away. And she's like, like, you need to of Brian. all the people, I could have accidentally... I don't know what... Like, in the only, like it comes up on FaceTime. Like, you must have FaceTimed him, like, right... Nope. Now. Yes, you nope. had two up. There's no way... Nope. Because you go through a different nope. app than you do calling. Nope. Yeah. I don't. I just go to their contact and hit FaceTime. You missed. Yeah. I, yeah. I missed you. For sure. Just saying. Ryan, it's one of those people that I'm always like, I don't know why I like him. There's no reason I should like him. <laughs> and for some reason you do. But for some reason I do. <laughs> All you two do is argue. <laughs> There's no reason that I should like him, but I love him. And it's stupid. <laughs> ah, well, this is awkward. That's exactly... <laughs> like, what the fuck? I never, never know what I'm going to find when I call Ryan. Like, sometimes, like, what are you doing? He's like, I'm plowing the driveway with the skid loader right now. <laughs> or I'm... <laughs> the boy... <laughs> it's always something new. <laughs> oh man that's funny stuff funny funny we can drink facetime me for my birthday nicole <laughs> i need i guess i need to get on cameo <laughs> you could make two dollars <laughs> what that's all you think i'm worth no i mean no What rigs do you have planned for scale naps? Oof, I don't know, but I got to start on something. I really, really, well, my class two may be that one on the shelf there, which is a. Uh, oh, yeah. What? There's a buy. Two fitty. Two fitty. He meant $2.50. 
I think people would pay ten dollars for me to cameo they could. on that. They could. Do you do CAD and program? I do. Ugh, let's talk about that. Do you want to? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you all about it. Verbal abuse from Nicole and OnlyFans. That's I already <laughs> said that. I would not do that. You wouldn't? No. Chartu bait? What is that? <laughs> Chatter bait. It's a Oh, I was thinking charcuterie board. <laughs> that's what I saw. When I Honestly, that's a good enough website. It's the same thing. Charcuterie. <laughs> same, same. On TikTok, I was like, I need this charcuterie. Charcuterie. <laughs> Charcuterie board. <laughs> you didn't say that. You know what it is, but you saw a TikTok. I saw a TikTok, but no, I love a charcuterie board. Are you kidding me? I like charcuterie boards before they were cool. I mean, I didn't make them, but I like ordering them at restaurants. <laughs> Pele Lindholm, good morning from cold Sweden. Minus 15. Oh. Ooh, that's cold, cold. Alexa, what's minus 15 degrees Celsius and Fahrenheit? Nicole's doing the conversion. Let's see. Where'd the other bumper go? Oh, well, no, I didn't lose a bumper. It's still in here. <laughs> Okay. There we go. Swear. Look at that. <laughs> See, after two, after two uh, Bloody Marys, I don't care. For sure. You need a whole pickle in the drink. That's not a bad idea. Girl. God in heavens. Hi, Sookums. Hi. Hi, baby. It's five degrees Celsius. I, guys... did, I asked my, uh, I had to ask my sister in law who's from Norway. Something on the TV was in Celsius. I was like, how? What is that temperature? I was like, I wish I had learned this in school. Uh, question, uh, do we run Haas or Mazak? We don't run either of those. We I'm run... sorry, Gunner. I know a woman making six to ten grand a month degrading men. She's never naked. No, I can't degrade people. Saludos de sede, Lima y Peru. Hey, Lima, Peru. Nice. Um, we run mainly Matsura, and we've got Citizen and Brother. Those are our main brands. Brother. They're, they're very nice machines. Little... Mazaks are nice as well. Haas, you know. Do they change locations or is it always in California? I don't know what you guys Those, are talking about. Is, uh, what, yeah, what are you talking Are you talking about Scale Nationals? Scale Nationals is in Alabama. Digital Bama. Monk, I think you are behind. Toto Africa cover by Leo somebody will change your mind. Well, he's definitely not going to hear that for another hour. True. Very true. Proline by the fire. Oh, I think it's always in California. Oh, Proline by the fire is always in the same spot. By Big Bear. It's in Victorville, California. Victorville. Not what you just said. Victorville? I mean, I call it that because of someone who lives there who calls it that. Right. By no... Right. Nicole, I can't do great people. Josh, but not people. <laughs> I mean, he knows I'm. What? That I love you and that, like. <laughs> Not that you're kidding, but that I love you. No, that like I'm kidding. <laughs> Are you going to Alabama for sure, Josh? Ryan wants to know. Uh, yeah. Me yeah, too. I'm going. Me too. Why would you not say me too? It's because well, it's a thought for sure. No, I'm going. Okay. Like, come on. Okay. You can go. Oh, dirty C. I like this. Rough estimate for conversion from Celsius to Fahrenheit. Double it and add 30. There you go. So, Nicole, you can FaceTime me again when he's gone. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I promise it'd be awkward again because I would definitely have clothes on. You can do it lovingly and make an extra 100k a year. <sighs> no. <laughs> Not worth it. Bad karma. <laughs> 100k a year. <laughs> Think of all the things you could buy Emmett. Think of and the race car I could have. <laughs> you? Yeah. Like a full size? Yeah. Well, okay. I'm sorry. Wait. I get the race car. No. Off-road race car. Huh? Off-road race car. First, that's not a thing. First of all. Second of all, no, it would be... I would... Hi, Sopo. Hi, baby girl. Hi. Come here. People want to see you. You... Y'all should get his AMC. Thank you, Mr. 1998. That is why I get to verbally abuse my husband because he does stupid shit like that. God, I hate you. <laughs> Hi, Suckums. Hi, baby. Oh, you can... What race car would I have? I think we've discussed this. What would you have? I would have a Chevy 2. Maybe a wagon. That'd be the actual race car you would choose. Yeah. What of a gasser? Oh, God. He grabs himself feet picks and buys his own puppy pack. There you go. Oh, you could. You have special feet. <laughs> Your feet are special. But like forest special. Huh? Like, run, forest, run special. Yeah. <laughs> Chevy 2, yes, says Squints, Paladors. Gasser, no. Gasser's terrible. God. Nova Deuce is the shizzle. Um, There should be scale hardware for the wheels, but I can't remember. So, the Jimmy. The, these wheels don't take scale hardware, Jimmy. Because these are in G, thank you, Nicole. Just start a YouTube channel and do separate narration of Rush's videos for Super Chats. You'd be a thousand air. <laughs> um, I'd copyright strike her ass every yes, time. But then I would have to watch his videos. <laughs> I'm sorry. Rude. No. BS410 chassis rig on your site still available since fart noise? Oh, uh, I sold it today. Well, yesterday, but I shipped it today. So, I've got to pull it off the side. It's gone now. No. I want an early 70s Mercedes with an LS swap. What? Shocker. Fucking shocker. Um, LS the world. I. What if I had a Fiat like my grandpa did? I mean, it's, my better, grandpa, it's better than a freaking gasser. My grandfather. Good. I'm glad your wife is looking up these cats that... It's from Carol. The Wild Haven Exotics. Wild Haven Exotics. Oh, right. It's called, no, it's, maybe it's not Wild Haven. It's Wild. Yeah. Is it? Are you sure? I feel like it's yeah, something no. different. Wild Haven Exotics in Arizona. Um, Tell her you saw her cats on the internet. No, she doesn't know. I know. She definitely does not she know. She knows the RC cars because I've sent her pictures of Sookie in the RC cars. Oh, that's why Brian's got shipped. Because you shipped somebody else's. I think yours shipped first, Brian. <laughs> and I didn't ship either of them. I handed them to Dan. I have a restored 89 IROC Camaro. Hashtag mullet mobile. Yes. Still cooler than a gasser. My 17-year-old son's given up RC for a 66 Thunderbird. He's doing an arrest in mod. Your 17-year-old is fucking cool. Um... But yeah, no, I take an Impala 409. Ben says, I know a little about drag racing. My grandfather was a top fuel, but front engine dragster dra racer. He actually died when he was like, what, 30 something in a front engine dragster crash. But he it was the IR IHRA, the International Hot Rod Association, instead of the National Hot Rod Association back in the day. So yeah. It's yeah. in my blood. That's why I get the drag car if we ever get a drag car. 
when Josh dies and I sell all those RC cars. What is Sookie looking at? She's just staring into the sky. Uh -huh. We think Sookie is an alien, actually. Sookie is an alien. Because she's constantly just staring up into nowhere. We think that she's communicating oh, with But the... I don't know what Pirate Rock is, but her arch enemy is the ceiling fan. Oh, yeah. If, God forbid, you turn that fucking ceiling fan on, she is... Nicole just hits the string on it just to send her into a... I do sometimes. Death spin. My 7-2 Blazer has a built big block waiting to go in it. It'll be dumb fast crawler. That no, but that that's dumb. Ha! God. All the nitrous. What? Uh what I'm sorry, there no such thing as a fast crawler. Like that's why I fucking hate one one crawlers. Like oh I'm gonna go do the Rubicon. You have a blast waiting for someone to bring you parts. <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> oh, it's pirate shanties saying like rock songs. I saw that on TikTok. What? Um, Perry's son listens to pirate rock, but he wears a fedora also. How are these all things that he ben just Ben Osborne says we were on Memphis Street. Uh, oh, he retracted it before I could read it. Ben Osborne. How many people died in your house before you moved in? I mean our house isn't that old. No, so he <laughs> no, she's definitely an alien. She's not seeing ghost. You're not invited That's to ride ghosts in it now. Aren't a thing Darn. Either. On the fucking Rubicon where you're gonna have to wait behind everybody else with broken axle. Or until you break one. Cool. <laughs> Sorry. Alex. How was your date? What's the cat wheel they run on? Uh one fast cat. Is the company? Ryan wants to know, like, you can't fucking catch you. <laughs> How fast is the Cheeto? Um, she's pretty fast. She is pretty fast. She gets nobody his... acknowledge Alex the traitor. I wish I was on. Oh, he said he wishes he was on a date. She's trying to decide if she's going to take the two of you with her as pets. <laughs> she hasn't me for sure. She likes Nicole, she's not a huge fan of me. She, you're fine. I'm fine. Yeah. But I mean, like, you're fine. Yeah, like, eh. Meh. You don't feed her, clean her litter box, or... You don't clean her litter box, either. Not anymore. The robot overlords do it. Now they do, but, like, before I did. She doesn't remember, then. She does. No, she definitely loves me a lot more than you. Talk Although she sleeps next to me. Well, like... Because you flop around like a I do. beached fish. Josh will be the outside pet. <laughs> <laughs> I know. You just can't sit the F still in the bed. I'm asleep. I don't know. We were on Memphis Street Outlaws last season. Took all their money. This has been... Fuck yeah. Alex, just kidding. We were all talking smack while you're gone. We were just saying how he was on a date. With someone he met at Comic Con, would you happen to have a clear image of the old VP Shield logo, hoping to recreate oh. and paint on the hood of the Phoenix? Kevin H, I feel like that may be an Instagram question. You may have to. I mean, maybe I've, message him on Instagram. Probably the best bet. I I don't have one offhand, but it's like you could probably find it if someone's gonna paint it. Probably something yeah. we have on the server. Probably. Oh, he, my friend got engaged today, so I had to pop over for a glass of champagne and some food. Because they got engaged. Like, you know what we did when we got engaged? Went to a fucking G6 in Canada. <laughs> That's right. The next day. <laughs> I believe the most expensive hotel room that I've ever stayed in, it was like $200 a night. It was way more than that. No, you wasn't. booked it. I, I would know. not have agreed. It was. It was that. It was like two hundred fifty Canadian dollars. No. Yeah. Promise. I will look it up. Look it up. Look it up. Because it was the most expensive hotel room I've ever stayed in. It was two hundred dollars. Anyway, and it overlooked Niagara Falls, and I had to get up at four a.m. so we could drive to a fucking G six. <laughs> There was caves. They weren't even caves. 
No, there's nothing wrong with Canada, Captain Calgary. We love it. We got engaged there. Like, I fucking love Canada. It's amazing. But she was not super excited that she had to leave at 4 a.m. to drive six hours. And then you took the hotel's hair dryer and not mine. God damn it. They said it. $200 a room? Come on, Josh. I didn't even book it. She booked it. And I just remember feeling like that was and yet, Nicole, way too much. Yes, I did. It's because I technically didn't ask Wait. her. And she technically didn't say yes. She just put on the ring. You said, are you ready? Don't drop it. <laughs> we were on a boat. And I definitely said, the fuck, Josh, during, our, <laughs> during my engagement. I said, fuck, Josh. <laughs> because he kept poking me from behind like, Hey, are you ready? Hey, are you ready? I was like, Josh, we're in the fucking falls. What the fuck do you want? Like, what? What? <laughs> <laughs> and then our Instagram photographer uh, took all of... <laughs> what? I'm kidding. Oh, I was like... Seriously? <laughs> um, but the Canada side is way better. Of Niagara Falls? Yeah. It was cool. Way better. It was awesome. Niagara Falls is amazing. Um, it's one of those things that you don't think would be as cool no. as it is. You're like, you hear about you it, you're like, You don't think it would be cool, but like, it was awesome. We could have totally spent two days there. It was fantastic. Um, it's not awesome. His girlfriend's a total bitch, but I guess they love each other. <laughs> I hate that. That's the worst. Oh, I've had so many friends so that did many. that. Like your girlfriend That's is. That's why we're going to second weddings oh, now. Oh, but uh, I mean. So many. You did the tour under the falls. Yeah, we did. The, we were in the boat on the Canadian side going into the falls. I don't even remember Niagara Falls because I was like, oh, my God. She finally gets to marry. <laughs> I was just. So, she was starstruck. I was so thrown off that I was like. I'm like, you could have, no, the Maid of the Mist wasn't, it, the Maid of the Mist we're was on the, on the American side. We were on the, the horn blower. Horn blower. The fancy one on the Canadian side. That was sneaky and funny. Oh, I think, I did not get deported from Canada, no. <laughs> even try, even after she was smuggling all that maple syrup back. Canada was my favorite. I loved it. Canada was a blast. So much fun. This is now your life. Yeah. Can I do better? Can I do better? <laughs> oh my God. They, the, all the mods waited for me to show this. If she's a bitch, but loves her, she does every unimaginable thing you can imagine. Wish him well and tell him to have fun until it blows up in his face. <laughs> the, that was, was what I sort of, I grew up with my dad always said like you, you know, you'd have all these family friends growing up and like the wife would be a not a nice part human or, or, you know, the, yeah, Quasimodo, whatever. And he'd just be like, let's give it a hell of a back rub. He said it all the time. I heard it a thousand times growing up. And I'm like, I don't remember what age that probably clicked, but I'm just like, I've oh. <laughs> like, <laughs> like you, like, he'd said that, a th like, I remember every time we'd leave certain people's house, he'd be like, she must give a hell of a bad <laughs> Like, after five minutes of spending time with whatever particular spouse it would have been, he was like. <laughs> <laughs> so, I mean, I like, I like. Back scratches. <laughs> I like back. I like back scratches, but I don't know. Wait, she said my dad said that. <laughs> like back scratches are nice, but I don't like her either. So I don't know. Like <laughs> <laughs> um, whenever you're like, eh, you made back rub. I'm like, I can buy you a massager for that. Like, <laughs> I don't, like you don't not. understand what I grew up with and what I think that means now. <laughs> It's been a while since I've been able to watch a Friday night build. Nicole hadn't committed international felonies last time I watched. I didn't commit an international felony. I've got the wrong passport. 
I mean, I did get deported from the country. I don't. I didn't actually get deported. They said they denied my entry to Mexico. That means you were the opposite of ported. <laughs> no. No, yes. I did not actually get deported. I just got denied entry. I didn't ever get into the country. What do you think that I'm? Um, you were in there. No. We were standing. I didn't on, make it through customs. Obviously. Oh, all I'm saying. Yeah, pull your tires. They're not that bad. <laughs> what do you think, Suckums? She's like, oh, it smells like fish. Perfect. She won't even smell it. Cheap would have licked it by now. She doesn't hate it at all. Because it smells like fish. And she stares at it, analyzing, analyzing. Yeah. Reporting data to mothership. <laughs> How does the phoenix perform compared to the origin? Uh, better than the origin. I... That was unported. Thank you. Unported. <laughs> Thank you, Adam. You know, it's got a the motors further forward and super low. It's got dig. Are those like, predator compounds? I don't think so. I think they're great. Because they're blue compounds. They're ucky. I heard there's a blue door in California and they could sell them a saw. Right, Josh said something. I think you'd be justified to do it again. Oh. Um said something about massage parlors and my mom was like oh I've seen them out here they're not the kind of massage parlors we have at home <laughs> I've been to them like they're regular massages I've been to one Ew. remember when my neck got all messed up Ew -y. they're just a massage okay until the FBI comes in I mean I think that they have to see you exchanging extra money oh you're disgusting Where's the laser temp gun? I think it's in the toy box. Uh, I'm not kidding. I was talking about it on Wednesday. If you click that button, like on the chief knows that sound. Oh, yeah. And runs Absolutely. it. He knows the sound. He's like, what? We're playing? This, is this battery dead? No. That's it's as fast as it goes. Righty, righty tighty, lefty loose. Oh. like watching a caveman discovering fire. <laughs> They're like, oh. You know they gave it the, one of the Kennedys so about me? Yeah. You wanna try the, it? The sister. Until you slip the extra four, 50. <laughs> you just put it up. You put it out of the in view. Turbo Charge Hobbies, how y'all doing? Drop it in while on my lunch break at work. Where are you? Must be running third shift. No, it's not third shift time yet, is it? It wouldn't be lunch break. Seven to seven. I I just know it because of the George Strait song. What? Shift work. Eleven to seven. Seven to three. Three to eleven. Whoa! I got Are it. Are you drunk? No. Drop the screwdriver. Or an Allen driver specifically. You want me to make a banana cry. Is that another one of the spammers? No, it was Phoenix. <laughs> I'm like, Kentucky truck plant, Louisville, Kentucky. Hey. Everyone's laughing about it. Can you tell me? What? I don't know. About what are they? A banana crack? I don't know what it is. I don't know the joke. <laughs> You're covering the wrong side. <laughs> <You know? laughs> because I was, <laughs> I wanted you to do it. And then I said something. Maybe that. I don't know anything about it. <laughs> the only reason I know how those massage parlors works when you get like for the extra stuff is from podcasts. Oh, okay. Nicole just said the dirtiest thing ever on YouTube. <laughs> I didn't even, oh, a hand drop. Thank you, Jesse. You can just pick up the laser pointer and our dogs will start looking for the red dot. Cut her off. <laughs> I wouldn't know that sober either. Like if I don't know a drink, I don't know it's sober. I don't I don't know what it means either. I think I don't know what I think about I don't get it. <laughs> I'm just 
the same. <laughs> Josh been overseas. I have not been. I mean, I have been overseas, but not to that part of the tourism world. Why are you with? <laughs> you want me, Jesus? Hey, now my wife was up at a time a massage therapist. Now she's a lawyer. Like, how amazing! <laughs> uh, thank you, Ian. What? It mean, I, just, I I still don't understand why that's what it means. Like, I don't get the euphemism. Oh, my, I don't know where my phone is. Don't Google it. Why? You're on our Wi-Fi. <laughs> I'm shaking my head at all of you. I've, and I've been to anime cons and walked in on a fur pile. Told ya. <laughs> you weren't part of the Vegas Nats that one year. Do you That's use hand power for all beadlocks? Mm, yeah. Gunner says you whisper. We still all hear you. Yeah, I got. I have a good microphone. <laughs> like, <laughs> my audio equipment. Is, I should put that on the spreadsheet. Dot 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 cry. Dot dot dot. Miss getting to watch the lives. It's hard to interact while slinging third row seats in the back of expeditions and navigators. Always have me cracking up watching. <laughs> I love navigators. I mean, new navigators, yeah. Y'all need you like the white, you like the trash navigators. Though. Yep. You like the two thousand two blown airbag suspension navigators. Say it to yourself with an accent. You want me to make banana cry? I, I don't want to keep saying it slowly to myself on stream. <laughs> Jay Burris is building a rift kit. <laughs> Paul's 1816 said, peace out. Peace. What do we get for $10? <laughs> I don't know. Shit, my nana's crying. Oh. I would love to go to Alabama just to team up with Nicole to really make Josh red. His brain. <laughs> it's all fun and games until you have blue bananas. <laughs> you broke the two of them, Phoenix. Uh, son of a biscuit. Yeah, no, I get it. I get what they're talking about. I just don't know what it means. Like, I I don't know why it means what it means. Babe. I get what they're saying it means. I just don't understand why it means what it means. Like, think about it. Why? Just saying. Oh, my God. Why, how is this so hard for you? <laughs> I get, like, why is it the joke? I don't want to clarify it on this video. I <laughs> I understand, Ryan, what it means. I just don't get one. <laughs> Thank you for the text clarification. <laughs> just a shitty euphemism. Spitting cobra. <laughs> I Get it. Josh, the banana Christ a charcuterie. <laughs> They're a charcuterie board. <laughs> it's just a shitty euphemism. It's all fun and games until somebody loses a freaking eye. Yeah, thank you, Jesse. Josh, just dumb yourself down a bit. <laughs> just saying. Well, this has gone to hell. <laughs> like, Welcome to Friday. Like the, you know. Dolly Parton sleep on her back. Like, I get, like, Wait, those I'm, are... What does that mean? Like, like, when someone asks, is bear shit in the woods? Does Dolly, does Dolly Parton sleep on her back? Oh. Like... You shoot your eye out, kid. <laughs> Good job, Phoenix. God damn it. Putting two Bloody Marys in your I don't know why. Like, I don't know why. I'm not a shit show. It's just a shitty euphemism. No, apparently. Not this stream is a brand risk. I get it. It's just a bad euphemism. Does dog pee on brick walls? <laughs> she sleeps on her side. She sleeps on her side. It's like a kickstand. Hey, you do not say bad things. It's like saying talking shit on Vanna. You do not talk oh shit on Dolly. God. Dolly's great. Vanna is a mummy. Stop. She is an angel from heaven. Stop. Stop. Only wide shots for Vanna. No! You stop. YouTube is not receiving enough video to maintain stream smoothing. 
That is because you talk shit on Vanna, so our YouTube went down. <laughs> the YouTubes. Yeah. The YouTube went down. You're about to lose your Ridge Wallet, wallet sponsor. <laughs> you do not say bad things about Vanna White ever in this home. Like, that isn't... I'm sorry. That is a no-go. I think your dad even agreed with me. Vanna My White. dad did not. Turbo Josh. I don't know what I walked into. I got to head back in, but thank you for the entertainment. <laughs> she is not a mummy. She is an angel from heaven who makes her own yarn. She has a yarn business. Yeah. And she has cats. And she is an angel. She's like every other super old lady. She's an, she is <laughs> she should have been. Vanna White is a fucking angel. I'm stop. <laughs> Do not. Nicole Nicole likes the wheel. She's a big wheel. I love fan. the wheel. <laughs> <laughs> I have a Vanna White joke, but I have to spell it out for you. It says Phoenix. Look. <laughs> I, see, that was a good joke. What did Ryan say? Oh God. No, no, no. Rob Barton says, I love Vanna. Thank you. I love Vanna too. <laughs> yes, she is my personal hero, Alex. Shout out to the fabricators and builders in the house tonight. Yee. <laughs> Raise hail, praise Dale. Secret Santa next week. Oh, trust me, I know. What's Secret Santa next week? When they you win whatever. Oh, they on win. the wheel. Yes. Oh my God. How long ago did we get demonetized? <laughs> it doesn't matter. I don't care. It's Vanna will outlive outlive civilization. Yes. Yep. She is someone. Some celebrity moved in next to her. You know what she brought over? Baked goods and knitted. Goods that she knitted with and baked with her own hands. She is amazing. Spun from the hair of the souls she's collected to stay out. Why? Why did like she is and she's dealt with fucking Pat Sajak. What's wrong with Pat Sajak? He's a douche. I hate He's a car the guy. remote to type one letter at a time. It's like my Netflix password is being <laughs> typed by Vanna White. <sighs> <laughs> do you always set your drag break break at a hundred no i i don't run all that much drag break i run a lot less than most people probably do i usually run like 40 percent. okay no one cares <laughs> yeah, let's what, get back to vanna white what's your nephew getting spoilers um let's see i got him crisscross crash yes i was on board for that Hot Wheels crisscross crash. I spent a lot ben, of time with that as a kid. Morning, I'm gonna block you. Um, <laughs> Who's who is that? Um, yeah, she's a non-prison version of Martha Stewart. Thank you. Um, he, I got him the. He likes to pretend, so I got him like the. Fisher Price medical kit that has like the shot and the stethoscope. Remember that one? The, the same one that we had when we were yeah, kids? Yes. I got that one. Hmm. Thank you, Ian. I was kidding, but it's fine. South Park's amazing. South Park. Have they made fun of her yet? I don't know. Um, What else did he get? Oh, I got him a Marshall pillow pet that also shoots stars into the sky. <sighs> got this thing all the way to a roller. Right at 9 o'clock. Sweet. Wheels and tires built. Shocks on. I didn't fill your shocks with oil. You're going to have to do that yourself. Betty too. White is amazing as well. Shocks on. Oh, we're red, baby. Now nah, we'll come back. They're going to leave you one. Who's the guy from Baywatch that has a European band? David Hasselhoff? David Hasselhoff, yeah. Um, when's your next build off? What else do um, we have? We have some plans, but it'll probably be after the new year. Um 
I feel like I bought him other stuff, um, but I don't remember. You don't remember? Yes, I. I believe that because I've seen the Amazon notifications. Like your blah 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 has been delivered. I'm like, what? Like, oh, there it is. A uh, grave digger for fifty bucks on Amazon. I don't feel like he's been brought into the monster truck lifestyle yet. No. Your your family's um, not big into the monster truck. Though. We are not. Shockingly. I mean, you would imagine. Yeah. Everything else leading up to it would lead you to believe. Are there sliders available for the origin? Will the origin bumpers come back to the VP site also? Um, these bumpers have never been on the origin on the VP site. Um, I don't know if they really will, but What's the sliders the are available. On that sweet Phoenix build asking for a kit. Friend. Oh yeah. Um, are you I've building got... something for Christmas that needs to go for one of the kids? Well, oh. I don't know about that, but either way, I should. I want to get that thing done. Um, secondhand RC said, finally caught y'all live. You guys got me rolling here. Vanna for the win. Thank you. <laughs> are there center caps for those wheels? I just noticed there, there are same wheels I put on my Phoenix. Perfect. Yeah. These are the Roswells. I'm trying to think rad. any other, any other ideas for a three-year-old? Three is a shitty year to buy gifts for. Why? I found them on the floor. Where can we get that aluminum radiator for the VS410? Um, that, like the one that was in mine was just a silver painted plastic one. They're, I know the sliders are on the VP site. I was asking if the origin bunkers will also oh, coke back. <laughs> they will not. They probably not. Bunkers. So. You guys should get matte skin colored sleeves for Xmas so you can wear them and tell everyone they were temporary. It's <laughs> a good idea. Every 25. No. No. She won't read. She won't even read Vanna jokes. No, because she's an angel from heaven. I'm being a hundred percent serious. Ooh. What? Play-Doh for a three-year-old. No. So I look at four-year-old gifts, but they they go from like five to seven, and like two to four. I already bought him a drum set. And a piccolo. That's a good one. A piccolo? Like a, like a record. Just get him a recorder so he can start now just playing green sleeves My brother. on repeat. No. Hot cross buns. Hot cross buns. <laughs> but he's three. Um, they can be annoying at any Big chonka trucks. I. Every three year old needs a ripper. <laughs> I thought they did have. They have a digging thing, but no one has anything to dig. I already bought. I bought a drum set when he was one for his. Oh yeah, Christmas. already got a drum set. Yeah, um, but I think the they card... have a digger that you can sit on and dig, but there's no dirt in their yard. So then it's have some to sand. Be mom and dad. Oh, you want me to buy him a sandbox also? I mean, what we could just have a load of sand drop it in their driveway. Oh, that's fun. <laughs> That'd be super fun. <laughs> Moose shot, no. <laughs> Brian, thank you for the two dollars. Well, might give me cap numbers. Couldn't find them. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's Moose shot. We may not sell the caps separately for these. Moose shot, thank you. Every twenty-five years, Vanna White and Pat Sajak renew their vowels. <laughs> we got him a balance bike last year. We, we did. Oh, that's right. I remember. Yeah. That. We could get him a sandbox, but like. This digger is super cool. You like sit on it and you can like. It's got the two handles? Yeah. Oh, I spent a lot of time on one of those. But like, where would he dig in mom's rocks? No, you need sand. We got him a power wheel already. We got him a power wheel last It's a gladiator there. just like mine. Same color and everything. Except for it's a Rubicon. Josh is an Overland. <laughs> <laughs> he has a nicer Jeep. We got him and I, Emmett and I, got in a fight. Um, my three year old nephew and I got in a fight about. A motorcycle because there was a, a tiny motor, a pit bike in front of us at a stoplight. And my mom was like, oh, Emmett, someday you can have a motorcycle. <laughs> and I was like, you cannot have a motorcycle. And he was like, but when I'm older. And I was like, 
No, you can never have a motorcycle. Coco will buy you whatever, whatever car that you want. But you can't. I'll, Coco will buy you a Jeep like Uncle Josh has. But I already have a Jeep at home. <laughs> and I was like, okay, well, like a real one. I'll, Coco will buy you that when you're older. But you can never have a motorcycle. But I want one when I'm older. <laughs> you could never have a motorcycle. See, you would have, you should have just promised it all now. That's exactly it. <sighs> what? No, I'm not. He can never have a motorcycle. I mean, we can start him off with a dirt bike. No. Well, he can have a dirt bike, but he can See, never that's have a, a motorcycle, a road bike. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Thank you, Jeremy Hicks. He wishes us a Merry Christmas from the and Happy Hanukkah. The Power Wheels Gladiator is like the real thing, except it hauls more. <laughs> it did have it did haul Clifford. It yep. haul, hauled Clifford really well. You drove the big red dog. All Sookie is on. Just keeps going. Oh my God. Yeah. She stopped. So, but we need more three-year-old gifts. I love. I mean, like. My brother doesn't need Play-Doh in his life. What's wrong with Play-Doh? Amber always told me, I was like, what are the worst gifts that you've ever gotten? She's like, fucking Play-Doh. Really? Yeah. She was like, never buy them Play-Doh. I was like, done. We never really had Play-Doh growing up either. My we mm -hmm. my mom would make homemade Play-Doh. No, we never had Play-Doh. We had the... I think she, she could just throw it away. We had a crayon melter. That you could paint with, so you can melt down all of your old crayons. Really? Yeah, and you, yeah. Huh. I've never heard of a crayon melter. Yeah, it was a crayon melter, and it had a bunch of little things. Can we talk about how weird it is when people call them crowns? I know. I don't know. I don't. Like what is that. wrong? Are you? If you're a crown person instead of a crayon person, you're a crazy person. For some reason, that got blocked. A VP should make high clearance training. Oh, you oh, said training. Yeah. I think my wife likes you two more than I do. Probably. <laughs> because we don't talk about fucking RC cars. Look how many people have logged off. I know. That's because we're done with the build. Who remembers the Vanna White song? The what? Ooh, there was, no. There was a Vanna White song? He has like a whole cleaning kit that he likes to play with. Uh, the kinetic sand is fun. Kinetic sand is fun. I actually had that. <laughs> I got you that. It was a desk toy that yeah. I had in my. Uh, no, that wasn't. It wasn't that long ago. As a parent, was anything when I was in that Kansas sticks, City. shoots, or makes noise, gift as a gift means war. We could get him like some. It's almost Nerf guns, but like he doesn't appreciate that as much. He's like more. I did get him a USB powered rocket oh. when I was back last time though, and he loved it. Yeah. No, he Duplo. He has those. My mom always said the store was sold out of Play-Doh. She admitted that it was because she loved her carpet. We, like, the I grew up... hot plate was awesome. Thank I you, grew mom. up in the time when uh, we had, we were big into Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle figures. And 91 they, Pro, we got a crisscross crash. Hot Wheels track, yeah, that was on. Uh, we, uh, we grew up with Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle figures. And they yeah. always came with, remember the slime? No. Well, they, each one of those, like, sets came with slime. We never were allowed to have this line. No. Yeah. And so, yeah. No. Van and White wasn't Playboy? No, there's no way Van... Maybe it was like one of those ones where it was like a... We didn't actually... Did y'all hit the like button? Did y'all hit that? <laughs> oh. Get him pool noodles and have him beat Josh. Uh, he would never. He fucking loves his Uncle Josh so much. Because loves I, his Uncle Josh so much, like I know how to play with the toys, right? Uncle Josh built a, him a fort last time we were back. Yep. So he he wanted to sleep in it. <laughs> Slime? You mean the ooze? Good, good point, Alex. I think that's what it was called. I came back to listen. <laughs> I feel like I had to leave, but like, yeah. No, I'm. I'm good with kids, even if... No, they, for some reason they love you, even though you don't do shit. Like, you're like, feed... No. He's like, you have to go to the bathroom. Don't you still wear a diaper? Like, 
it's just because we're on the same snack schedule and, you know, like we just get along. We're just like, I'm done playing with this. You done too? Yep. Something different? Yep. Sweet. You hungry? Yep. Like, let's do bar? this. Do you have a bar? <laughs> All right. It's 9.05. We got this thing to a roller. Roller. The, do you need two horses? We're sending this back to I think I'm gonna Lubbock? Give, I think I'm going to give it to Moose Jaw so he can mount the body Moose Jaw painted. And uh, Moose Jaw can get all kinds of photos. And then I can ship it back so Moose Jaw doesn't have to if he needs me to. Um, but I think we need to get final photos for... Jimmy Two Horses. Jimmy Two Horses. James. So we can get the same thing. So... It's a good how looking does one kit. remove paint from Elixir body? How does one, don't ask me on how to remove paint because I use the wrong chemicals and make things worse. Banna White Playboy search results are hot. Thank you, Perry G. Hmm. She's an angel. Okay. Well, now I know how to end streams to talk about Vanna White. Well, yeah, I gotta go search it. So, <laughs> I'm sure it was from the late 60s when she was in her 40s. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> <laughs>